Hello there, my lumpies and my germs. How are we doing tonight? Hey, 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 hey. Sorry for the delay and everything. Not the delay as in this started. I actually started on time for once in my miserable life. But uh, I meant the delay in terms of, like, trying to keep up with the chat and everything. It's quite difficult. Um, oh my goodness, I'm getting I'm getting cheers already. Thank you, guys. Very kind of you. Um, ah, there you go. There's the noises. I couldn't hear the noises, so I wouldn't have been able to see. Oh my god, so classy one. We're gonna, should we just go, we're gonna have to pre-start this with all of the, all of the cheers and support. Classy169 bits, very funny. Hey, Caddy and family, hope you're all well. Super glad that the streams are back, as they always lift my mood after a bad day. I was just wondering, what is your favourite piece of video game music? If that's too hard, then what was your favourite soundtrack? Keep up the great work, and don't forget, if you, if you get stuck tonight, and too much people, too much niceness people, losing the messages. Don't forget, if you get stuck tonight, L3 will guide you. No, I don't need guidance. Shut up. Favorite soundtrack? Um, oh jeez, I don't know. Um, the Which soundtrack of life? Uh, no, from a game, honey. Oh. Not from life. Um, oh. I suppose um, Mario Galaxy always jumps to my head like straight away. That's 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 a that's a fantastic soundtrack. Um, but there's so many. Uh, I, there's so many. Shadow of the Colossus is another one. Uh, I I can't quite think off the top of my head. But yeah, it's a lot. There's a lot of great soundtracks out there. But anyway, I've I've got sorry, I've got to get through all of these other all of these other nice people. Banjo Man 1997, 100 bits. Thank you so much. Hey Caddy, I tried to mention this the other day, but it got buried in the comments. Yeah, sorry, that is entirely probably what happened. Things will get buried in this chat. There is a lot going on in it. Um. Anyway, I mentioned about a car crash on. God, I'm more people being nice. Thank you very much. I'll get to you in a sec. Um. I mentioned about a car crash on your Crash um, crash 4 reveal. Yes, you did. Yes, how's everything going? Um, I'm all fine now, fortunately, but I had a limp for ages. I damaged my right foot. Oh, my God. Hope you're okay. Um, the driver of the car felt so bad he took me to Amsterdam for the day. Well, he owed me anyways. I failed to win a bet that was to drink a litre of gravy in 15 minutes. That sounds like the most insane story of all time. Um, but I'm glad that you're okay. Just make sure that everyone is... Is uh, is careful. That's that's all I can say. I'm glad that you're okay though, dude. Thank you. Um, 69 bits from Abyss Wraith. Have a good stream. Thank you for the laugh. Um, Rhiannon is in in the chat. 69. Why is everyone sending 69 bits? I don't know. Is that something we don't know? I don't know. Is it is it 69 day? Uh, What's going on? Like you're just very lucky that Amy is sitting next to me on the sofa and doesn't know what that means, and I'm not going to explain what that means live on camera. What? Exactly. Um, hello, Caddy. I'm very drunk, but I had to jump in on my birthday quickly. Yes, it is your birthday. Happy birthday, Ree. Nice to nice to know that you're getting drunk. Um, hope everyone enjoys the stream, and thank you for birthday wishes. That's okay. Um, we've got um, Zoom, who has subscribed. Thank you so much. Inflim has resubbed for three months. Just made it. Missed Monday, as I didn't know you were back, so glad to catch you today. Yes, I've got a solid schedule now, if you can believe it. Um, Clockwork Bard, five bits. Thank you so much. Um, Code Cody's nuts. Jesus Christ, that's the worst name I've ever seen. But thank you for the resubscription. Love the Pixar video, Caddy. Thank you so much. Um, uh, we've got forty bits from Mikey Bud. Thank you so much. Um, Peeperonize Bag. I remember you from yet um two days ago. Thank you so much. Good evening, Cads. Hope you and your family are well. Glad I caught you on stream tonight. Need a bit of an uplift as I've probably rough few days. Much love. I'm really sorry to hear that. Um, but just make sure that you have some pepperoni, and I think you might be okay. Tell you a joke, oh, okay, Amy, needs to, you what? need to think of a joke for pepperoni. No. No? I can't. Well, that is a joke, I'm isn't terrible. it? Yeah, that's why That's why I'm asking. Um, 09 Havocworm donated $3. Hi, Caddy. I hope you are good and enjoying the game. I am. Thank you so much. Sea Monkeys 999 subscribed. For, um, thank you so much. Um, 100 bits from 09 Havocworm. So much hype for the hype train. Oh, that's why there's lots of bits. So if somebody starts off a hype train at the start of a stream, it takes us about 500 minutes to get actually into this into the gameplay. Uh, good. Well, when I get when I get to uploading these onto YouTube, I will remember that for the future, so that you can just click on the um timestamp to skip all of the um, lovely thank yous. Anyway, we were. Wait, what's happening? I I can't really remember. We're controlling Abby. So this is Abby's backstory, and she's the one that killed um, Joel. I you were just gonna say back. Um, but this is what happened basically right after she killed Joel, which is not very fun. Oh, oh dear. Okay, so I just need to move everything around a little bit because that is right in the way 
of my controller hand. Okay, right. No. No. No, that's terrible. No, that's terrible. No, it's got to it's got to move back. Just leave it. I'm not leaving it, Ames, because I'm not happy with it. <laughs> Wait, what? How did how did we end up? What? What? Know. Why isn't it moving? Because it's still on the same thing, and you're not. I don't know. Okay, right. There we go. There, right. It's still not right. Why? Why am I not central anymore? What have I done? That's what have I done differently? Oh my god, you this isn't. Yeah, I know, but why is it still? I don't know. There's still a gap there, though. There wasn't this. This wasn't there before. Oh. This what that wasn't actually there before, but now I can't actually get myself right to central. There. Maybe you need to move. Okay, that's central. Happen. There we go. Oh my god. Okay, I'm just gonna have to. Yeah, the controller's right on the bloody mic. I need to figure out another way to do this. This is really maybe awful. Move your actual arm. I'm. I need to. Yeah, where, Ames? Where am I going to move my... Exactly. Think about these things. Maybe the table was I can't remember. Um, I don't know. Everybody wanted to see Caddy's ribs stream. Hey. Yeah. The best stream. Yeah. Uh. Oh. Oh, Come on. <laughs> Come on. Ah. Okay, the mic is far too close now, so I can move it back a bit, which means I can move it up. Oh, the mi the microphone's the wrong way up. <laughs> no, 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 that's that's why. So now, so now I can lift it up a little bit further. Oh dear. Because I need to lift it up in order for it to reach my mouth. There we go. Right. So there we go. Now I've got plenty of room. Now yeah, there we go. We've got we've got room. We've got room, everybody. Great. Right. Let's do this. I forgot I didn't pause the game. That was very lucky that I didn't get stopped, actually. Okay, right. Hello, dog. Anyway, what's happened here? Oh, Damien Castaway. Thank you for the 1,500 bits. Very kind of you. I've returned from military training and passed. Here's some bits in celebration. Even though you did nothing, I still want to celebrate with you. <laughs> I, d I did a lot, actually. I gave you the inspiration to carry on. I'm going to take that as a victory for both of us. Thank you so much, and well done for passing. That's something I could never do. You are much better than I am. Um, Clockwork Bard, three dollar donation. Thank you so much. Um, hi, Kelly. Been sub to your YouTube for a while. Finally gave in and came over to your Twitch. Sorry, I can't tip more. Saving up for my first car. Keep on keeping on. Do not even begin to apologize. We have this conversation every single stream. Anything is appreciated. It doesn't matter how small or anything. You're not any better or worse than anybody else. That it, it, it's it's fine. Is basically what I'm trying to say. I don't expect anybody to do anything, let alone donate, so it means a lot to me. Thank you, Clockwork Bud, for the 145 bits and the gifted subs from the Purple Sloth Zero. There's someone out there. There is somebody out there. It's there. creeping. Mm. Can they see Abby's elbow is the question. Mm. Oh, God, I need to... Okay, that's as good as I'm going to get, I think. Parry Panda donated $10. Thank you so much. Sup, Caddy? This is just a thanks for getting me back on retro gaming and uploading um, your streams to YouTube. I work as a database admin and working long nights with your streams in the background helps a lot. I'm glad. Thank you. That is what they are there for. I'm very happy to hear that. Yeah, people have things on in the background all the time. You don't have it loud or anything. You don't actually pay attention. You just kind of have it as background noise. And if something interesting happens, then you jump in and um, listen to what's going on. I've done that. I've done marathons of people's videos before like that. Yeah, that's what I do. Then I guess I don't have two screens, do I? Well, you don't even watch the other screen. It's just on in the background. Oh. Okay, I'm going to have to grab you. With two. Okay, I'm just hoping that... Okay. Not a word. Hmm, I'd be interested to see how this works out. Maybe not 
There we go. Look at that. Partner kill. That was pretty slick. Um, okay, right. Oh, yes, I've got a silencer on my gun. Are you going to play Ghost of Tsushima next? Asked oh, 09 Havoc Worm with 100 bits. Um, no, I'm actually going to play... This was um, something that I asked my Patreon supporters. And they all said that I should play um, Spongebob Rehydrated. So that's my next game that I'm going to be playing. Um, and we've got Damien Castaway with 500 bits. Um, thank you so much. Fair enough, here's another 500 for helping. <laughs> I was I was being an ass just then. You don't need to give me more support for being horrible. You've done a good thing there, dude. Well done. And um, 69 bits again from the classy one. Not very classy of you, I've got to say. How is Stan doing? Hope he's doing well. He is healing very, very well. The vet bill is a bit of a pain in the ass, but, you know, life, life does that to you sometimes. Oh, no. Pet Pan US replied to me. I've been, I've been ignored by the UK one, yeah. Yeah, Pep, uh, yeah, what well, did you see what they said? They said, oh, yeah. Two separate pet pets now. Oh, oh, maybe I did get a proper reply then. I'll have a look. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's too late now. I rung up and complained and cancelled, so. Because that was the dumbest thing I've ever seen. Oh, I've got an idea. Pipe bomb. Oh, damn it. Going prone. They can't have gone far. Right, got my silencer back on. Yep, your whistling ain't gonna do shit. Well, yeah, I remember, honey, on, on when I made that tweet, um, Pet Plan US replied to me and said, "Oh, we're not the real one. This is you're you're talking to the wrong company." Yeah, no, Pet Plan UK oh, well, can you can you actually get it up and see what it yeah. says? Because I'd be interested to hear how they justify this. Thank you for the 427 donation, Sam Lolol. Well, I'm I'm not lolling at that, but thank you, Bingley Bungley Boo. Remember when I said fetus delete us and you laughed? I do remember that. Thank you. Thanks for the laugh. Hope you and the Briggs are having a happy marriage. What is your opinion on the mobile Xbox thing? I have no idea what you're talking about with the mobile Xbox thing. But um, the Bricks and I are having a bit of a rocky stage in our relationship because the Bricks ran away and took my wallet. But I, I know they're out there somewhere. They're going to come back, I'm sure. Yeah, so for anybody that isn't filled in, or cares, <laughs> while I'm playing The Last of Us 2, um, essentially what happened is that we, um, we were on one pet insurance scheme for years for Stan, but it wasn't the best. It was fine, but it was pretty cheap, and you... G oh, sorry, uh, yeah, well, no, I was going to say, you got what you paid for with it. It wasn't the most expensive per month, uh, but you got what you paid for. So whenever you, we had a vet bill, we had to upfront the entire cost and then give it a month or two and then they eventually paid us back. But that's what you get when you pay for a cheaper insurance. So we decided after that debacle to go for a more expensive one with Pet Plan, which I know now is in the UK and in the US. Turns out when they signed me up, I know you can blame me for not reading the contracts and the terms or whatever properly, but I still think even rereading the terms that it's ridiculous. Basically... Um, pet insurance um, people won't give you cover for pre-existing conditions which I figured would have meant a condition that's ongoing that was ongoing on the previous insurance and is now going on into the new insurance. Stan doesn't have any pre-existing conditions, he's not on any medication for anything, he doesn't have brain problems, he doesn't have anything like that. All that happened, and all that we claimed on his last insurance, was an operation on his stomach, which it turned out wasn't needed, so he didn't have a problem with his stomach, we just had the, the x-ray covered. Oof. Um, and then we had the, um, um, the broken leg situation, which we did need covered. It turns out when I signed up with Pet Plan and ended up paying more per month, I think it was double the price per month that I was paying on the other insurance, um, they had snuck into my uh, my terms and agreement 
By the way, you can claim on anything except for anything digestive related, anything joint related, and anything with broken ligament related. So anything that made, made my dog go to the vets, anything, they wouldn't cover. And I don't consider that a pre-existing condition. He broke his leg from an accident. We thought there was something wrong with his stomach and there wasn't. We just needed to go into the x-ray and make sure he was okay. And cut into his stomach to make sure there wasn't a blockage. But he was okay. There wasn't, an, uh, there wasn't like a condition there. And then with the joints, we've gone into we've gone into the vet multiple times talking about his joint pain, which is what has led to his broken legs. It's not a pre-existing condition. But yeah, so they had basically signed us up with a scheme that was expensive, but refused to cover us. Oh, damn. I thought I had a suppressor. And yeah, so um, so then when, when we had the vet bills. Oh, God, I thought you were a man. You are a man. I mean, an, an evil man. Um... Yeah, so we had the vet bills and everything. Um, we sorted out the, the claims. They were supposed to pay it off for us straight away. And instead I get an email saying, oh, by the way, we're not paying off anything because... Uh, well, they didn't even tell me. They just cancelled it. They didn't pay us off. Said in the email that they gave me, everything is explained below. It wasn't. There was nothing. And I can, Karis can attest to that because I showed her the email. Wasn't explained anywhere. It just said, broken leg. Like... That's not a reason. That's what happened to him. So then I ended up having to ring them up and ask them what the hell was going on. Then they filled me in about the terms on my contract, so which I said, okay, then cancel it all. No, thanks for nothing. Um, yeah, I found out we'd paid over the last few months like £700 worth of pet insurance. And now we're going to have to cover about £1,700 worth of vet bills, which is fun. All because they wouldn't cover it. And that's not a plea for help. I, I'm this. No, don't get me wrong. I'm not saying, oh, woe is me. Give me. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm just saying airing my frustrations because that's a fair amount of money and they fucked us out of it. And I'm just not happy about it. So, yeah, pet plans suck. Oh, what, what did they say, honey? What did they say to my tweet? Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. Oh, dot, dot, dot. Well, okay. Okay. What are you gonna do, man? What are you gonna do with your woman? Are you gonna are you gonna do something? Oh god, you can attack back. Well then you get an axe in the face. Oh or in the ribs. Ow. Ow. And that is not something I'm going to be covering your vet bill for. God, there's loads. Wait, where even are you? Oh god, Ames, I'm not even going to bother explaining the plot. You missed four hours of game. I'm not explaining that oh, really? much. In Flim, 100 bitch here. <laughs> stand fund. No, do not start doing a stand fund. I don't need a GoFundMe. I don't need support. I'm not airing my dirty laundry for the sake of getting sympathy. I'm just explaining how how bullshit this situation is. That's all. That's all I'm doing. But thank thank you for the support, but that's not what I was doing it for. Thank you, though. Um... Love all you do, bro, says Acid Hunt with a resubscription. Thank you so much. I am your wallet, says Damien Castaway with 100 bits. Um, well, if that's the case, you've been sitting next to my bollocks for a couple of years now, so uh, joke's on you. Sorry, Ames, I know you didn't need to hear that, but that was well, a... I... <laughs> To be fair, you should be in bed, so I don't care. But... <laughs> okay. Well, guys have them, so... Well, they do. I can't. I can't pretend they don't. Yes. No. Yeah. No. You only did that once because yeah, there was one time ages ago where Moom thought it would be hilarious because one day you asked her when you were still living at your old house before I moved in with you, you were asking Moom's um what a <laughs> testicle was, and then Moom's thought it was a hilarious idea to tell you to ask me, so you rung me up. 
Yeah, and I was like, well, am I going to be telling a four-year-old what a pair of testicles are? I, I don't know. Should I? Should I was put in a very strange situation. So, um, yeah, that was a that was a fun day. I could have said it's an octopus leg. I don't think you even knew what an octopus was at four years old. Because it's like a tentacle. What? Because it sounds like tentacle. Well, if you knew that, then you would have known that it wasn't a tentacle, because you know what the word tentacle was. So I don't think that would have worked. I, don't, I think the wool wouldn't have been pulled over you your eyes. Quickly. Oh, so a tentacle is, is on an octopus. Yeah, okay. That would have worked, I suppose. Sea monkey. Um, sea monkeys 999. God, emergency sea monkeys. $3. Thank you so much. Been a fan of your channel since your Sekiro review. Wow, you're a new um, fan. Thank you so much. Um, this isn't much, but I want to support you in any way I can. Hope you reach 1 million subs. I want the Spyro video so much. Love you, Caddy. Thank you so much. Um, it's, it, look, it's still massively appreciated. That is not a small amount. That is, that is a small amount to some people and a massive amount to other people. So don't start comparing yourself. Thank you. Um... It's thick and awesome, 50 bits. Um, expect to see more stand funds because the viewers in the stream are incredibly generous. Yes, you are, but that is not why I brought this up. I'm not even doing a reverse psychology thing. I genuinely did not bring it up to get sympathy donations. I'm just saying black and white. Disclaimer. I was just really pissed off with the amount of money that's gone into this. And and because how someone how Yeah, I didn't just bring it up out of nowhere. This is not a Dark Side Philip stream. Through here. Okay. Classy one, 200 bits, which also says stand fund. I, I don't, look, I didn't mean to do this. I really didn't. Thank you, guys. It's like it's my birthday all over again. Just leave them to it. Okay, here's an idea. I'm going to pipe bomb these two. Can they not see you? Oh, they blew up! Oh my god, that was gross! Go, dog! No, dog! Well done, dog! God, that was nasty! Oh, damn it. No, 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 no. I mean, yeah, this was bad. This was a bad move. Okay, right, right, right. I'm running out of ammo! Oh, hello. Ah, oh, headshot coming down the head. The hedge? The hedge? The fence? Welcome to Caddy Doesn't Know the Difference Between Metal and Grass. Got ya. Oh, hello. No, missed ya. Okay, that's fine. God, there's so many of them. I don't know, there's so many. Why? Oh, are these friends? Oh, they're friends. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay. That's okay. I wasn't shooting them, I shot the guy that was aiming at them. Ooh. I love you guys. I'm gonna name all my children after you. Ready? Glad you guys are around. Maybe you drove by. I heard all the shooting. Oh god, Linkaro 69 bits. Oh, I don't know what's going on today. It must be 69 day. Stand funds from me and my mate who are watching this together. Brick style over Zoom. Oh, thank you so much. Didn't know you could do that over Zoom. Parry Panda donated $6.90. 69. What is going on, guys? It's not funny. It's quite funny, actually. Yeah, it's it's all right. Yeah, well done, guys. I, get it. I know you don't get it, and I'm not about to explain it to you, Ames. Two hundred bits to Harper Onions. Thank you so much. I just tuned into you talking about testicles and four-year-olds. <laughs> no context. Caddy is having a field day right now. I'm sure. Um, yeah, don't worry. It wasn't anything bad. It was a case of. I don't remember. I don't know what. I don't know how we got onto that conversation. It was talk. Yeah, yeah, it was, Mum. Yeah, talk talking about we were just talking about how when amy was much younger she oh, and they i know oh, i'm just i'm not going into detail i'm just saying when she was much younger she didn't know what testicles were she heard about it at school i think and then i think you heard the word somewhere like no, nobody would have told you that word at home so you heard it from somewhere and then you asked your mum what it was and then mum didn't want to tell you so you thought it'd be funny to tell her to ring me up on mum's phone and ask so that's what that was about hey, let me see your hand uh, Damien Castaway, 100 bits here, thank you so much. You must travel to Ag... What? I'm sorry, I'm lost. You must travel to Agralag... Agralalabar? To... 
No, it says Agralala Bar. Oh, is that from Aladdin 3? To defeat the teleporting toucan before it wraps you in a tortilla and sends you into... Is this a lol random tweet? I think it is. Not a tweet, a, a cheer. Yeah, Space Dementors, Depth of Space... Yeah, yeah, that was lol random. Very random, very random. 50 bits from Banjo Man. Don't worry, Caddy, I once taught a four-year-old to say bollocks and don't piss on the floor. What? What, you taught a four-year-old to say that and not piss on the floor at the same time? No. Wow, it's like a, <laughs> a second-rate dog you've got there. Classy one, it is funny. 69 bits. Okay. It's freaking awesome. 69 bits. Next hype train has entered the station. Oh, so it's all the 69s that started a hype train. God damn it. Well, there's nothing more hype than a 69. In Flim, 69 bits. Lol. Platinum Warps are 50 bits. Hey, Caddy, out of curiosity, have you played Paper Mario Origami King in your own time since you made a tweet about it when it came out? I enjoyed it myself personally. Haven't played much of it. I've played about two and a half hours, three hours of it. Yeah, it's great. You did all right back there. But then I haven't played Paper Mario 1 or Thousand Year Door, so I, p I couldn't possibly comment. Stay. I, got, I don't know how it stacks up to the other ones aside from Super Paper Mario, but um, yeah, it's a good game. It's different, but it's a good game. I feel like Paper Mario is um, Nintendo's experimental franchise. They don't want to just stick to one thing. They just want to try. It's almost like Paper Mario is made, of, uh, made out of toilet paper. So Nintendo have a load of ideas. They throw the shit at the walls and then Paper Mario comes in to wipe it down. That's what Paper Mario is. Every single game is something different. And they don't want to risk using it on an actual Mario game. So they use Paper Mario instead. Hey, who we got here? Come on, girl. Oh, wow, Damien Castaway with 200 bits. That lol random was actually something a drunk guy was screaming in a pub last yeah. night after we got back. Thumbs up. Oh, my good These God. Secrets. Well, then he was being quite lol random. In fact, that was that's too lol random for a drunk guy. I reckon he, well, I reckon he was sober and pretending to be drunk so he could get attention. That's what that sounds like to me. You, no, drunk people can't come up with thoughts that coherently and can't come up with such specific random situations and circumstances. They can't do that. They can barely stand up properly. How are they going to know about space dementors if they can't wee straight? Wow. Thank you, six, $6.90, Parry Panda. Hype, have a good stream and good night. Thank you so much. Sounded like a talk show host there. Basil, resub for four months. Thank you so much. I just went into the chat. Can you please say hi, Ocu Blocks? I think I already said it just then. I hope that was okay. Uh, anything around here? We've started a new upgrade tree and stuff with Abby, so it's actually worth looking around to see what we can find. Oh, who am I talking? Hey, you done with Monte Cristo yet? Uh, almost. Give me another week. I'm at the end. Just Honey, where's the um, um voice? Uh, the um One voice, week. the volume control. Thanks. It's doing that stupid thing again where the explosions are ridiculously loud and the talking is ridiculously quiet. Ah. Uh, Clockwork Bard, 70 bits. Abby's arms are ripped. Oh, yes, they are. They absolutely are. Um, da Damien Castaway, 300 bits. He has a Long Island iced tea and screwdriver, so who knows what state, what his state was. I was just guessing he was drunk. Oh, I see. Right. Well, yeah. Prob probably, I got, I guess, high off of iced tea, I guess. 100 bits from Shadow Dragon. Thank you so much. So how are you enjoying this game so far? Is it as bad as everyone says it is? Personally, I still love it. I, uh, like I've said in every single stream, if you think this game is truly bad, then I fucking, I don't know what to think. This is a quality made game. It, it's, it's, there are games like Fallout 76 that are, not only visually inferior, but gameplay inferior. Do not even work. Don't load. Glitchy. Overpriced. Tons of DLC that, and microtransactions. And it's so bad that even Todd Howard needed to make a joke about it at everyone who worked on the game's own expense while he got away scot-free and everyone looked at him as some sort of goofy fucking CEO. That shit is bad. This is not bad. You can not like it, but... To, for people to call it the worst game ever or the worst game of the year, I don't, I don't get it. I do not get it. I definitely don't think it's as good as the first one, but this is a good game. Like, I would hate to see what you think of Homefront or, or anything, anything. I can't even think of an example. 
There's so many examples of mediocre or bad games. This isn't one of them. <laughs> this is just not one of them. Oh, did I get all the coins? Cool. I'm assuming that's what that achievement was all for. Oh, some screws. I'll need them. For screwing. I'm not being naughty. That's what they do. You, you use a screw to screw. I also got another achievement just then. What? Or trophy, rather. Sorry. I've been playing a lot of Xbox and Steam recently. I will in a sec. I think I picked up every single scrap thing. Um, I'm not actually too sure. Um, oh, really? Uh, I kind of wanted to upgrade the stability on... I can't remember what I wanted to upgrade, but it wasn't the pistol. I know that much. Oh, my goodness. We have got a lot more... Um, 50, oh god, 50 super set 80. 50 is in the chat. Uh, 69 bits. Hello, Categories, you've just been cheesed. What does that mean? How have I been cheesed? What kind of cheese? I don't know. Cream cheese? Mozzarella? Tell me, man. Damien Castaway, 100 bits. This is a forward of a question someone's asking. I'm putting it, I'm put, put I'm poofing it forward? You can't say that. Uh, putting it forward is a pre present to them. Can you please say hi, Oculblocks, again? I didn't get it on camera. Oh, hi, Oculblocks, on camera. Is that okay? <laughs> it's freaking awesome. 101 bits. Games used to not have stories, so the game itself is freaking amazing. However, the story so far is not as good as the first in so many ways. Okay, yeah, I think that's a bit of a weak argument, personally. I see what you're saying, but there are games on Super Nintendo that have no story at all, or even games like Shovel Knight, which have barely any story which I would rather play over this. So I don't know if that's necessary. It's it's every element works together, basically. And if you don't have a story, or if you have a, if you have a story um, that's uninteresting and boring and drags and it gives you lots of it, then that's when it can be considered bad. But if it's a story that itself is bad and lazy, but they don't focus on it, like with something like Shovel Knight or the Mario games, then who cares? Why would you complain about Mario's story when it doesn't give you any story? You pet, you put a game in, you play the game, right? So I don't actually think that's a... a, a yeah, I think that... No, it's not, not a good argument. It's it's fine, whatever. I'm just saying it's, it's a bit of a weird one. Um... Shadow Dragon. Sorry, guys. There's lots and lots of bits here. I will carry on in a sec. Um, Harper One is 200 bits. Abby makes the lesbian in me swoon. For some reason, the whole testicles thing reminded me of Red Dwarf. I would agree with you, but I don't like Red Dwarf. So, sorry, I don't. I don't like it. I don't find it funny. I'm sorry. I just don't. The only thing I appreciated was that the guy, that the robot guy, was all polygonal, like an old 3D, 3D model. That's the only thing I like. And cat. Those two things are the best thing in Red Dwarf. The rest of it, I could shoot. I don't care. I'm sorry, I just don't. I know that's going to piss off a lot of people, but no. No, I'm not sleeping downstairs. Fifty has said sixty-nine bits again. It is cheddar because I've cheddar destroyed you. But why was I cheesed in the first place? I appreciate you keeping the the pun going, Fifty. But what does that mean? Um. Oh God, two hundred bits from Damien Castaway. Putting it was supposed to say. Yeah, I figured. <laughs> Autocorrect is the bane of my existence. Oh yes, I'm aware. I'm aware. Well, I've just gone into the chat. We Winky Poo is asking, and I just have to answer because I cannot, I can't ignore somebody called We Winky Poo. How would you rate this game out of ten? Solid eight so far. No, it hasn't. Hey, man. I can't right? see it being a nine. I definitely can't see it being a ten. Yeah. But this is a solid eight out of ten game. Okay, what's going on here? Oh, can I go out again? I don't think I searched everywhere. 
Classy one with 69 bits again. How long before this gets old is my question. 69 minutes? Yeah, okay, cool. I'm with Keris here. You should sleep downstairs after that comment. Okay, you guys can watch Red Dwarf together and I'll, I'll avoid it because I don't like it. So <laughs> everyone wins. Harper Onion's 200 bits. Thank you. No, the cheese is that cheesy bastard. I haven't even thought about that for ages. Okay, 50's just keeping the cheese puns going, so I'm going to stop reading them. Sorry, 50. You can take cheese too far. you taking it too far. Thanks for the bitch here, though. Very kind of you. Speak of the devil. Hey, guys. How you doing, Melon? She ca yes, he called her Melon. Which is more accurate for her stomach, to be honest, but there you go. 50 bits. Relax. Um, Shadow Dragon. Oh, sorry, sorry. Oh, God. I'm sorry, Shadow Dragon. I missed your question. I think you missed my question about the thoughts on the, this particular story. You said my name, said it had a ton of bits coming in, then moved on to another question. Sorry. Uh, wait a minute. Where are we? All right. Had a chance to relax. Oh, yeah. I'm glad you enjoy the game as a game, but I'd also like to know your opinions on the story so far and the decisions the game has made with it. As I said, I love it, but people hate the story so much. Um, <laughs> again, if there's, you can not like the story. You can pick up, pick out, pick apart everything you don't like about it. That's cool. Whatever. You do you. I do me. I don't think it's the worst story I've ever ever seen. I don't think it's the best either. It's not emotionally pulling me in the same way that the first one did. It's not as captivating. Um, but it's not awful. It's not bad. It's decent. That's all I can really say about it. The decisions they made feel like they make sense to some degree until that bit in the last part of this stream where we figured out that Joel had actually confessed to Ellie that he had done what he did at the end of the first game. Because then that just doesn't ex that doesn't that doesn't compute in my head about why Ellie is so overreacting in the way that she is. If she did know, I don't think we ever needed to know. That was the biggest blunder the story made so far. Not what happened to Joel or anything like that. Let me out! Why can't I leave? Have I soft locked myself? No. Now you step out the way. <laughs> I just wanted to see him walk back. <laughs> Oh, dearie me. I guess they're dead bodies, Ames. Yeah, they look like it. Can't tell Mel, all right? Why can't I? What can't I tell Mel? Not yet. Come here. Oh, is this the, the boyfriend or something? Who's in that body bag? Yeah, I think that's the biggest blunder the story has made so far, and the fact that, to be completely honest, everything we've seen oh, so shit. far. It's Danny. This is this is a multi-layered and clever revenge story. As far as revenge stories go, it's pretty smart. There's different reasons of justification for both sides, and there's a weird moral high ground that these guys are taking that is very childish, um, in order to make their justification on firing back on Ellie seem righteous. So there's in the terms of the revenge plot and the cycle of violence continuing on and on and on. Yeah, I think it's quite a smart story in that sense, but. I, I just don't think anything needed to happen head. after the first one. I, I It's not an awful part two, but it is a part two that I don't think needed, needed, needed to happen. I don't think anybody was begging and asking what was happening, especially with new characters and everything. If anything, it, was, it should have been just Joel and Ellie. But then it makes sense what happened to Joel. This is the problem. It makes sense, but it didn't need to happen. So, whatever. Which means you can't say shit. Always a big boy. I'm sure he's fine. Where is Isaac? I'll be discreet. Last I heard, he was um, in the apartments. And because I was answering that question, I don't know what's going on. I'm gonna go <laughs> check on this is what happens when you don't play a game for about a month. I know someone died, Ames. I just don't know who or now what we're doing. Okay. Why the hell hasn't Isaac sent on a search party for Owen? Okay, we're looking for Owen. I fucking hope so. Thank you for the bits, Classy One. And you're asking everybody what's everyone's favorite video game. 
inside. Go on in. Thank you. Damien cast away 300 bits just because I can before I go. Oh, well, thanks for dropping in and thanks for your incredibly generous contributions. Very kind of you, dude. Thank you. Oh, it's thick and awesome. 50 bits. I guess what I meant was splitting up the two elements. I'll admit, probably not a good idea, but if you ignore the story and look, the gameplay is really good. The story wasn't done very well, so it wasn't a great way of explaining my... Oh, no, no, it's fine. I just... No, I wasn't being... I wasn't being an ass. I was just saying that I just didn't think that the... What you were trying to say originally was a... a um, a, uh, a grounded argument, but no, I see what you mean now, yeah. No, gameplay-wise, this is better than the, f the first one in nearly every way. In my opinion, anyway. There's a lot more nuances, a lot more subtleties, a lot more detail. In Flim... Uh, okay, I'm gonna stop reading 69 bits, because that joke is now officially old. You're older than my gramp, so stop. Not funny anymore. So, 69 bits. Haha. <laughs> Here's the last laugh. <laughs> and then we read the message. It was a person who caught Ellie after the horse incident who she killed and got that picture off so long ago. Oh, okay. That makes a little bit more sense. Thank you. Right. Only explain myself wasn't saying you're an ass, it's ficking awesome. Oh, no, it's... Don't, don't worry. No, Karis, shush. You're supposed to be helping me, not telling everyone that I'm an ass. <laughs> Thank you, Karis, Karis, Mime, Karis, Mime, for the subscription. I think that's how you say it, Karis, Mime. Yeah, Karis, Mime. Hey, Abby. We need to go up. Ezek's in there. Oh. <laughs> well, they don't need to go up then. It'll be long. So to get him when you two arrive. Come on. Ellie appears to be suffering from what I'd call Lara Croft syndrome, ping-ponging from murderous psychopath to emotional wreck, says Harper Wunyans. <laughs> well, um, thank you for the 200 bits. I would agree, but the problem is, is that this isn't the Tomb Raider universe. This is the Last of Us universe, and the mental toll that that this kind of life will have on somebody while you have to murder people makes sense. I I, I don't think there's that much cognitive dissonance or whatever it's called. No, not cognitive dissonance. What am I talking about? No, what's it called? What? Narrative dissonance. What's it called? Oh, Someone in the chat strong. knows. Not cognitive. It's um, when oh, when you when you have a story like in a game like Uncharted, you have Nathan Drake, big good hero guy. He murders five hundred million people completely like without thought, and yet you're still supposed to see him as the hero. That's called something narrative dissonance, I think. Somebody in the chat knows. What's going on, boss? Ludo narrative. Thank you, Shersha AD. Ludo narrative dissonance. That's what it's called. Yes, Sir Toasty. Yep, yeah, that's it. Yeah, I don't think there's much Ludo narrative dissonance in The Last of Us purely because this is a very specific world that the game has built. But Tomb Raider is the normal world, so that that's a little bit more crazy. And so is Uncharted to a degree. For our side. Sir, we've tried attacking their island. Not like this. Not with everyone. It's a big storm a few days out. We're gonna use it to mask our approach. You two are gonna lead the first wave. Pick your squads, start prepping. I want Owen. When are he and Danny getting back? Secrets between the Salt Lake crew, huh? Is someone okay? As far as I know. Then, then why didn't you send a search party after him? He shot Danny. Apparently to protect some scar. It's bullshit. Excuse me? It's not Owen. You got it wrong. You're saying Danny used his last breath to lie to me? Sir. People hear Dad's story. Owen's dead. 
anyone who finds him. They'll gun him down for sport. And I suggest you all stop gossiping about it. Let me go after him. I'll walk him back in. We'll get to the no. boat. No. You said yourself the storm's a few No. Days. We've only got one shot at this. And this is bigger than any of us. Definitely bigger than Owen. If he turns up, then fine. I'll give him the benefit of the doubt. And we'll get to the bottom of it. I need you, Abby. and go through your roster. Grab some food. We'll talk later. No way Owen killed Danny over some scar, right? Okay, I'm just gonna say right now, I know I'm in the middle of a cutscene, but this this whole right. thing this whole part of the get this is just branching off now. Abby, We're twenty hours no. in. I'll be back by morning. You just gotta cover me till We've now gone back in I time to another group of I characters to try and figure out their motivations. Which I was already able to grasp just there. by going what against them and about? seeing them in cutscenes. I know where he'll go. And playing as Abby first before then her taking over before taking over Joel and then having Abby kill Joel. So it's like, oh, we just controlled her, you know. I don't think this was needed at all. This is just padding. I don't get this at all. I'm gonna kill you. What? Yeah, I don't I don't need to see Seriously, stop it. I don't need to see this Abby backstory stuff. I got. I understood her character based on the way she's been behaving from Ellie's point of view, because that, because that's how good storytelling works. You understand the villains. You don't need. You don't like Star Wars. A New Hope. Star Wars Episode Four didn't need to include Darth Vader's backstory in that movie for you to kind of. No, not even that. No, Return of the Jedi. Sorry, not the first one. Episode Six. They didn't need to include an entire segment dedicated to his backstory in that movie to explain. Or you can go I'm just no. That's my see. that's my point, honey. I said it was a good thing. It doesn't what need. Do yes, it doesn't need to do this in order to explain yeah, the motivations true. and why Vader did the certain things the way really? he did and why he killed the Emperor. Bloody 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 blah. Spoiler alert. No. Don't talk about it. I mean, obviously, I know that there's the other films that then go into the backstory of Anakin Skywalker, but at the time, no one needed to. No one needed that. It was cool that it was gonna come out, but nobody needed to needed that to understand more. And then they go into the more political aspects of Star Wars universe, and then it actually got cut, kind of interesting. But yeah, see what Don't I mean. Do not. It is too high. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> you know, I don't think I can live like this anymore, Abby. Owen, I'm serious. I will break up with you. Owen. I always loved you. Don't! Owen! <laughs> yeah, you that. That was stupid. You're just kidding. Oh, it's me that no. I've got to do. <laughs> oh. Uh. If you kept your body um, completely straight, it would, wouldn't, wouldn't it? I'd say that was as, about as high as a um. Down here, you asshole. High, high jumpy boardy diving. What's it called? A diving board. High jumpy you water board. <laughs> and you came to my rescue. <laughs> is that what happens no? when? Is that what happens when you get <laughs> a monkey sure to you to torture you? <laughs> a high jumpy water board. Uh, I found something. Oh my god! Oh awesome. god! Sorry, everybody. What? I think you're gonna have to follow me to see it. Hard boiled one, 77 bits, thank you so much. Have you any interest in the Last of Us HBO series after playing both games? Yeah, I'll watch it. Oh, and we have to I don't back. I don't I I don't see the point necessarily. Because the story will be told exactly the same way because to warm up to us. The Last of The Last of Us is interesting because the gameplay and the story are separate and together at the same time. 
They're separate in the sense that you don't need the gameplay and the game itself to enjoy the story at all. That you can completely disconnect from the two. But you also have to play the game to, for the sake of great survival horror and for the sake of you feeling the struggle and the developing relationship between Ellie and Joel and what everything that you ha as a player have been through. But it will be told exactly the same way. I don't know how it could be told indifferently, but I'll still watch it if it does. Classy 168 bits. <laughs> now that was funny. I'm interested in what Keris and each of the kids' favorite games are. Good question. Well, I think I know what yours is, honey. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yes, games ever. I think I know. Animal Crossing New Horizons. It has to be. You've put 400 plus hours into it. It must be. It must be. No, uh, of all your favourite game, just ever. Mm -hmm. So that's New Horizons for you. Oh, on the 3DS. Well, I think when you when you got started into Kirby on the 3DS, which was tri Triple Superstar Ultra, whatever it, bloody hell it's called. Triple Deluxe, that's it. When you got into that, you played it non-stop for a few days. Whereas with Animal Crossing, you say you use it as a distraction. So I would say that it was Kirby. Phoebe, according to um, an Instagram story she made a couple of weeks ago, is Rayman Legends, which I didn't know. <laughs> but she did it on an she said it on an Instagram story. I didn't know that. Um, well, that's something I didn't know. Um, and Chloe, <laughs> oh, no, I don't know. It can't be Animal Crossing. She lets her villagers die. Yeah. Child of Light. She's playing a lot of at the moment. She's yeah. She plays Mario Kart probably the most. It's freaking awesome. Fifty bits. Thank you so much, Candy. Is there a game that you played that is so bad that it's fun to play? Ride to Hell, I'd probably say. Yeah, I do want to finish that. I'll start from the beginning with another stream, but yeah, that was that was incredibly fun to play. Um, Harper Wanyan's 200 bits. If Abby was Ellie, she'd have carved Isaacs um, for just saying no to her. Wait, if Abby was Ellie, she'd have caved Isaacs Sorry, that, sorry, Harper, that, I can't understand what you're saying there. I'm really sorry. 50 bits, Sea Monkeys 999. Thank you so much. 100 bits from Shadow Dragon. Thank you so much. About your points um, about the sequel and the show not being needed. Yeah, I agree. They aren't really necessary. No, I, I, I think I, if, if Naughty Dog had come out and said, oh, look, we're doing a, a follow-up like, Uncharted game with Drake's those, kids uh, or like a kind of old snake kind of thing, like Metal Gear Solid 4 but Uncharted 5, I would have been down for that shit. Um, this, I, I think The Last of Us 1 just ended as perfectly as it needed to. And I'm not against them expanding that at all. I'm not. But I just don't think that anything that I've seen in this game has made me think, holy shit, this is why this game had to exist. I haven't felt that yet. Another 100 bits from Shadow Dragon. Uh, okay, I meant to keep typing, but accidentally hit send. I agree it's not n very necessary, but I think it's more fun to have stuff like this. A nice dish, and I don't hate being a thing. Just some straight fun, in my opinion. Yeah, no, that's exactly where I am. Exactly where I am with that. Then you, The problem is, though, I think why people are a little bit upset is because of how this game is for some people or mediocre or whatever what some people want to say it's what naughty dog have done to their employees and what they've pushed them through in order to get it out when ultimately it didn't need to happen in the first place that's what people are upset about i think well and that there's a woman with muscles in it i guess i don't know hey give me a hand with this yep oh sorry holding the holding the triangle What is this place? Well, clearly this is some sort of theater, but for uh, fish. Okay, <laughs> Jeff Goldblum. Ah, uh, oh, hardboard one, seventy-seven bits. Ever try Rayman Redemption, the fan remake of Rayman One that addresses a lot of his archaic design? I played it for twenty minutes and I adored it. If that if I if that dude needs I mean probably not get a job at Ubisoft because they're not actually that nice of a company are they as we've discovered but um they yeah no if he could get a job like all that Ubisoft need to do is get that game he made and sell it and give him a massive cut of the profits because you don't need to play the original Rayman now that that game exists you don't it is 
it has made the original Rayman for me from a 5 out of 10 into an easy 9. Easy. Easy 9. It's incredible. Absolutely. And if you haven't got it yet, it's a free download. You are missing out if you don't get it. I thought, oh, it's just going to be like a little fan hack of the PC version of Rayman or something. No, it's redone from the ground up. Widescreen support, 60 FPS. Menus have been done. Remastered music. Sound effects redone. Power-ups in every stage. It's so good. Different difficulties. Different challenges as well. Different locations for the um, Teensies and everything. Not the Teensies. That's Rayman 2. The... Um, Electoons. It's so good. Harper Onion's 200 bits. Abby's non-buff arms look wrong. <laughs> to be fair, with her body shape, if she maybe that's why she... That's why some people do that, you know? Their body shapes don't complement a certain type of... Like, it's, it's like, um... Yeah, it's like, imagine seeing a wrestler that... Or, like, someone post-wrestling. Okay, no, 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 no. Take Dwayne the Rock Johnson. Hmm? Okay. What? No, I'm saying... I'm not complaining. Every time I bring up something, I'm not complaining about it. I'm saying, imagine if he stopped wrestling, went into acting, but then stopped working out. Like, how his body shape would look, he probably knows how it would look, and he probably doesn't want that to happen, which is why he works out. And that's probably why, in this universe, Abby did the same thing. She probably looked... Didn't like the way her arms looked. Close. It didn't match with her body shape, and so we're like, okay, well, if I'm going to do something about myself that I can be proud of, I'm going to make my arms big. I don't know, you know, there's a million different reasons. Also, if Ellie was in Abby's position, she'd caved Isaac's head in just for him saying no to her. <laughs> Probably. She's a bit of a wreck in this game. Oh, Jesus. Maybe they joined the wolves. Are these, are these infected? Such an optimist. Hmm. Thank you for the gifted sub, Blakeub115. Very kind of you. All right. Enough of this boat. You want to go see the rest of the fish zoo? You think there's more to see? Of course. Let's go. I'm not against them telling the story in the way that they want. Like, that's artistic expression. They can do whatever they want, but I'm not... Unless every single element here comes back in a roundabout way, I'm not seeing the point of any of this. I didn't need any more depth on Owen's and Abby's relationship, I've got to be honest. I, I don't see the point of this. Especially 20 hours into the damn game. This is... Yeah, what is this bit meant to be? I don't know, Ames. It's just trying to... Trying to build sympathy, I guess. Someone in the chat earlier said you'll be glad that they told it in this way, but I just don't see how all these subtle character dialogue interactions are going to Im like change how I feel about the characters that I have judged from the beginning. I still feel the same way. Which is that I don't think there is a good or a bad guy in this situation. I think they're both just as flawed as each other. But maybe the WLF are a little bit worse because the way that they behave makes them feel like they're morally righteous. But then that's what Joel did. So basically Ellie's the one that's being pulled along here. So we take a quick look around and then... We head right back. Uh-huh. Except that this is nothing. Classy 168 bits again, thank you. I would like to see you properly review Rayman Redemption. Would you consider doing on video on the inconsistent world of fan games or something that just to prove you can talk about Rayman Redemption? I was thinking about it. Maybe like remakes or something. Because there are a lot of bad remakes. Um, or like ports or whatever you want to call them. So yeah, we'll figure it out. I'd like to think that's not a real whale. I'd, I'd, uh, I'd hope. Ah, seals, my one of my favorite animals. Hey Owen, no spots. Hmm. Sea puppies, yeah, they're sea poops. That's good. Yeah, get them to break the rules too. You don't think it's worth it? Stingray Bay Cafe. God, how many more A's could you need? I can't hear you, Owen. Sorry. Oh, God. Oh. Interesting setup. Ah. So a family lived here. This is cool. 
Oh. Okay, that I wasn't expecting Hello. to see. What happened to you? Hello. I think this is our boat, Captain. Shit. Dad, I'm taking Max away from here. He can't spend his life locked inside this rotting building. All he'll do is take on your weaknesses. When the soldiers killed Mum, you just stood there like a coward. What kind of example is that? You should have gotten angry. You should have made them hurt, hurt worse than hurt, they hurt her. I want Max to see what it looks like when people are willing to stand up for what they want, when they're willing to make something of their life. The world is harsh. It's up to us to change it. When, uh, only when weak may I carry my true strength. Maybe we'll be back someday. If we do, I hope you're not still sitting in your stupid fucking chair. Um, well, he didn't, he, he broke that promise pretty quickly. He went straight back to the chair Jeez. and n not only did nothing, but decided to oh, cuddle the note. On the bright That's side, pretty depressing though. Found these keys. What is wrong with you? Shadow Dragon, 50 bits. I really want to tell you why I like the Abbey stuff, but I don't want to risk spoiling something. Just know that I feel it has its own strengths. Yeah, don't, please don't, please don't. I'm just saying that as somebody who has not played this game for the first time, 20 hours in, I don't see the point of bringing this up now. Fanatics. You were naive. Because this isn't this isn't changing my mind about any of them. I didn't I like I went from hating them at the very beginning of the game and being like, oh well, they've got to die now to now understanding and being a bit more sympathetic. This isn't making me hate them or be more sympathetic anymore. This is doing nothing for me. This doesn't serve anything for me anyway. But we'll see. I mean, I haven't finished the game yet, we'll see. It might all come full circle, who knows? Oh, by the way, honey, it's ten past eleven. Oh, fun. Thanks, it's definitely perfume, my dear. Oh, okay. <sighs> Sorry, that's my fault. you imagine this place filled with people? Kids laughing, running around. Different world, right? I say that nowadays whenever we go to town to pick up Chloe. <laughs> Can you imagine a different time? Kids running around, having fun. <laughs> I say that now. Oh, was there something on the back? Oh, I don't care. Why am I pretending that I care? I don't. What's this? Baloney Heights? Oh no, the open ocean experience. <laughs> Baloney Heights. Let's go in, guys. You get to see the origin of the baloney. Oh, no, not you. Got it. Have a nice sleep. Somebody in the chat was asking... Oh, yeah, so Kate... Um, sure, sure, yeah. You were asking if I saw any of the story stuff on Twitter. No, because I don't take any pleasure or giddiness out of actively seeking out for that stuff. And to be honest, even though I wasn't looking out for it, because I didn't even search the news, I, I nothing in my algorithm ever popped up in my feeds anywhere to spoil me of the story details. I never clicked on anything. I just don't take any of that stuff. I, I just don't. I, I don't take any pleasure out of it. If you do, great. If you want to know everything that happens before, like, what, whatever. But then, like, I get it. Like, some people, for some people, money is tight. They want to make sure that they're getting a good story or that it's worth buying. I, I get it. But for me personally, no. Because I was going to get the game anyway. So there was no. I was going to get nothing out of um, spoiling the story for myself. I know nothing about what's going to happen. Which is why I'm staying away from the chat more in this um, series of streams than most others. Just in case everything gets ruined by someone who just wants to watch the world burn. What will you do, honey? Tell them off in your account. I went very naughty. Look at these. What? Look at what? I'd love to meet this kid. I mean, he's a scar. Maybe you have. Ah, Jesus. I sure hope not. Excellent crap. Thank you for the 200 bits, Harper Wanyans. Kenny, would you rather have a longer game with less quality or a shorter game oh. with higher quality? Get on in here. Well, it depends what you mean. I mean, a bad quality game is bad whether it's long or short, but I can tell you for one thing. There is a reason I stopped fucking playing Assassin's Creed Odyssey and Assassin's Creed, um, um, Greek. Which one was that? Oh no, Origins. Origins was the Egyptian one, Odyssey was the Greek one. Sorry, there's a reason I stopped playing both of those games. As mechanically solid- <gasps> There's seals! As mechanically solid as those games are. Yeah, as, as, um, 
as mechanically solid and polished those games are to a degree, if you bloat your game structure and make it boring or repetitive, then I'm going to stop because I know, oh god, there's going to be another 40 plus hours of this. I'm an advocate for shorter games that are more concise and more directed and better, like, better paced. You can have the biggest game in the world and have the biggest area, biggest open world, biggest this, biggest that. But if, uh, but if you've got nothing to show for it, then who cares, you know? And no matter how good something is, I will get tired of it if it's too long. When I finish a game, I want to be able to go, oh god, I want, I wish there, no, no, that's not true. Because if I said, if I said that, oh, um, when I finish this game, I wish there was more of it. There's two different ways you can feel about that. You can either feel, I wish there was more of it because there wasn't enough, or I wish there was more of it because I enjoyed it that much, but I'm glad that it's over. A, d a game has, for me, has to be a dessert. Still out Not there, like you know? a McDonald's meal where it was great, but I wish there was more of it. Just a nice closing dessert where it was great, and I wish there was more of it, but I know realistically I shouldn't have any more because what they did was good enough. That's how I would describe it. The difference between a pudding and a pasta. You go ahead. What about you? Thank you, Connor Strange One Four Five, for the subscription tier one. Thank you so much. I'm sorry. I told you already. Don't be sorry. Okay, so that was a nice flashback. What if Owen's somewhere else? He's there. Let's get off the roof before someone sees us. Can I talk you out of this? No. We don't know what happened. I gotta find him. I mean, if you really killed Danny... Fuck Danny. I'm jealous Owen got to shoot him before I did. Whoa, Abby. But. I do appreciate you helping me sneak out like this. How are you oh, getting to it? Damn, that? look at this. Jesus I Christ. Win. Can't. Too many patrols. I get spotted for sure. How is this running on a PS4 it. without it screaming? I think I should make that clear as well. I know I'm running this on PS4 Pro, but it is not sounding like a jet plane. There's no noises coming from the PS4. Mm. It is purring. It's incredible. Oh, we got a PS3? Yeah, we do. What have you been playing? Oh, you've not been playing anything? Well, I can't fire? I was going to shoot the PS3! I was going to say, well, you're not going to play anything now. You can't play Resistance now, can you? <laughs> Fuck you. Um, okay. In here. Checking the drawers. A singular screw. Awesome. Checking the drawers. Five singular screws. Awesome. Down the hatch. Through the doorway. Hey. Thanks. Oh. Nice. Yeah, and, and other stuff, you know. Wow, there's You're a, a workout bike there. Come on, Alex. You know I can't handle all these emotions. I don't know where they think they were going with that workout bike. I mean, the, the wall's right in front of them. They probably didn't have enough room, but uh, well, who am I to complain? It is, after all, the end of the world. Probably shouldn't get picky about details like that, should I? Classy one, 68 bits. The PS3 can never be destroyed. Oh, it can. I've gone through more PS3s than any other console. Come on. 
No, PS2 I went through more than any other console. PS3 second most. No, I'm talking out of my ass. No, it was just PS2. PS3, the old one I had... I'll do my best. Um, the old one I had still works. It's been working for years and years and years, but it wouldn't fit under my TV, so I had to get um, an, another one, a, a slim model. Just follow the sunset. But yeah, the one that I have, the one that I had when I first, when it first came out, and I've had for years. I even I upgraded the storage space. Um, it was a, it was a f six. No, it wasn't a sixty gig. It was a um, forty gig model. So it wasn't that much memory at all. Um, and I remember specifically undoing that was the first time I'd modded something I put a new hard drive in it to take like a 500 gig or something so instead of buying a new one I just upgraded the memory myself and it still works I just couldn't fit it under the telly that when we moved here so I had to get another one mm -hmm. one step closer to buying my upgrades for my my lovely suit goon it's freaking awesome. 70 bits. I had to go to dinner. What did I miss? Deja vu. <laughs> you like going to dinner, don't you? Maybe it's just because of the time that I stream. Oh, what does it smell? You. <laughs> oh, oh, that was a good animation there. Well done, game. Very impressive. Okay. Right, who's around here? Yep. Saw that coming. You can tell usually when you get into an, an, an area where you won't be able to climb back out of. That's when enemy encounters happen. So that you can't run away like a little old puce. It's up here. Ah. Rags. My favourite. Alright, onto the truck. No, that's good animation work there. Very impressed. Figures. Mm hmm. I guess I'm going over that wall. Okay, going over the wall by going through the house. But we heard gunshots, so let's be let's be careful. I think that's probably a good idea. Oh, I need a canister. I need to get some more um suppressor stuff. Oh, another coin. Nice. Let's just leave the dollars in there. Worthless. Who needs them? What are you gonna do? Pay a clicker? It's not looking for tips. Okay. Through the gap. Yeah. That's what I was worried about. We should have brought the money with us. We should have tipped it. Where's my 20%? Oh, damn it all. There went my throat muscles. Thanks, thank you so much for the hint game because that was why I died. It wasn't because I got stormed at by a zombie. It was because I healed at the wrong time. Thanks game, thank you. Okay, let's try this again, shall we? There we go. Wait, what? Not dead yet? Oh, to a great start. Yes, we already died. Well done, Abs. Two hundred bits from Harper Onions. Can you say goodnight to the girls from me? Oh, um, they all just went upstairs. Sorry, dude, but um hello to Keris and Stan. There you go. Hey. Says Harper Onions. Oh, and Stan's p poked his little head up. Aww. Good boy, Stan. Well done. 
Hmm. Jeez, that's a big TV for the year this was set. Supplements, supplements, supplements are good for my body. Give me all the supplements. I put them in my butthole. And that'll make me stronger. With my yogurt and my calcium. More supplements. God, it, today is my lucky day. What can I upgrade with my supplements? Ah, shivs. I remember shivs. Sharper clarity. Yeah, that's probably a good thing to get, isn't it? Yeah, I'll get that. Steady aim. That's pretty good. I'll go for that. Oh, thank you so much for, from Strem for the $5 donation. Hey, Caddy, just wanted to say thank you for doing what you do. You have and still continue to bring ha many happy, nostalgic memories playing old PS1 and PS2 games. Would you ever consider doing a video about Tombi, as I feel is a very underrated game? I agree with you. And I was thinking of doing, like, a forgotten PS1 games or something video at some point. We'll see. More supplements. Yeah, boy! Twelve of the little bitches! Twelve of the little bitches! Shove them in my eyes! Oh, we got a canister. Nice. Oh. We uh, we drew our gun on automatically. What? Something about to happen? Yep, let's craft a suppressor. Just what I need. Thank you. Okay, you're about to hear me sneeze. <coughs> I'm a loud sneezer. It's more of a cough than a sneeze. And I sneeze out my mouth, not my nose. Anyone else do that? Cheesy Chopper, 100 bits. Nice to see you, Cheesy Chopper. Hey, Kelly, welcome back. I hope you and your family are well. Much love. Much love to you too. Yeah, we're okay, thanks. How are you doing? Oh, hello. Okay, right, so we've got a few of you guys. Okay, you're just going to be a problem, aren't you? I'm going to try and take care of you while I can. Oof. Don't even know if I can. Oh, yeah, infected can't see... Don't see light very well. Okay, right. Hide behind the fax machine, the biggest office appliance ever invented. Oh shit. Ah, really? Okay, I didn't waste all my ammo, but still not great. Oh, there's another one. Oh, it's a clicker. Are you kidding me? Oh, damn. Oh, okay. That was all right. Oh, classy one. 68 bits. Excellent sneeze and great dab, too. Oh, my God. Did I do an unintentional sneeze dab? Please, please kill me. That'll be on my tombstone now, won't it? Jim Caddick. Here, now here lies Jim Caddick. Accidentally dabbed when he did a sneeze on stream. It's freaking awesome. 70 bits, thank you so much. It's okay your sneezes aren't that loud. By the way, if you have ever woken up in the middle of the night, it's probably because you heard my brother sneeze. Oh, that's what that was. <laughs> Iron Ninja here. Hey, dude, how's it going? Hey, Caddy, what did I miss? A lot. I've been going for about... um. I can't see, actually. I can't see how long I've been going. It doesn't say anywhere on my screens. I've been going for a, a while. So, an hour and a half, I think. So, yeah, you have missed quite a lot. Oh, 
Oh, Phoebe showed up and now she's going again. I think Har I think Harper Wanyans has already gone. I know what your favorite game is. You said it on Instagram. Yes, you did. On a story. You don't even remember. The internet is very throwaway, everybody. There's your proof. Rayman Legends, you said in your story. Oh, yeah, Yeah, that's what games do. <laughs> you play you, you, you play games. Oh, I see. Oh, okay. That's an interesting way of looking at it. Yeah. Yeah, watching and playing, yeah, different different experiences, yeah. Oh, Harper Onions is still here, actually, 200 bits. What do you think Happy's workout routine looks like? 40% supplements, 60% arm crunches. Um, I reckon it's 100% supplements. Um, and um, I think she... I don't know, I'm too tired to think of anything clever. Sorry for disappointing you. That's what happens when you catch me live. I don't know. I don't know what to say. Oh, Stan's enjoying a cuddle with Phoebe. Oh, that's nice. Good boy, Stan. He's getting very bored. Poor thing. Oh, no, no, you have a nice sleep. <sighs> oh, Mad Hatter Cesus. Sorry, I missed you there. 100 bits. Hello, Caddy. This is my first time. I love you. Thank you. Very. That's a lot of you. No, not a lot of love. A lot of you. It's a lot of me apparently. So the love is the love is pretty meddling, but the me is quite big. It's a very large me. It's not I love you. It was I love you. So that obviously means there's a very long version of me that this person sees. And hey, if you love that long version of me, who am I to say get rid of it? Okay, what's down here? Ah, can I go in here? Okay, there's a hole in the roof. This feels like a very open battlefieldy kind of thing, so... I feel as though we're going to get attacked. It, we, it just feels like that's what's going to happen. Gate. Truce is dead, but you just keep coming back here. Hmm. Oh shit. Okay. Um, that was unpleasant. Oh, I thought they were bones. Oh no, it's fencing. Okay, I thought they were human bones. I was really freaked out just then. My prophet, I ask that you grant me, may you bring, no. Perhaps what I ask is impossible, but I must ask. Bless the wolves with your insight, with your wisdom, with your love, that they might renounce their selfish ways and lay down their arms. I don't think Abby's going to do that. I don't think she can put them down. May you bring peace to this world. Well, she hasn't done a very good job. Easy. Stay on your island. Huh. Wonder what they are doing here. Hmm. Classy one, 68 bits. Cannot tell you how many times I've confused fences for bones. <laughs> well, for, to be honest, dude, I, I started off, I was confused with fences and hedges, and now I'm like, confused between f fences and um, bones, so everything just melds in with me. My prophet, I wish to rejoin the hunts. May you grant me wish for a new steed, sift and strong, a new saddle and a new bridle. So is this like... Is this like a, a, a wishing well? It's a wishing fence. So people write their wishes down and then they and they stick them in the fence. <laughs> my profit, my wants are few, my needs are simple. But my hands are clumsy and I'm unable to contribute to the efforts of our village. Mending, forging, build, basically doing anything. Give me these abilities and I might be productive and respected. 
So I guess you were never productive or respected. Because that would not have happened. She can't just wave her magic fingers and give you new fingers. It doesn't work like that. Prophet, I am a good soldier. I have already freed two wolves in your name and will send you many more. Please honor me by letting me live long enough to see your salvation spread across this land. I don't think you want to see any kind of spreading across the land. I thought she was going to say spreading legs, but, you know, whatever. But that's why it looked like it was going. Iron Ninja, 100 bits. Wait, Phoebe is going to bed. War, war flashbacks to Final Fantasy VII stream. Hope my bits aren't out. <laughs> My prophet, may you bring your children prosperity and strength that we might cleanse this world of its sickness and start anew. Well, that didn't work either, did it, you moron? That's a big ask, dude. How about this? Harper Onions, 200 bits. You're being way too good to me today, dude. Thank you so much. Has Stan had to get over the cables tonight? No, he actually hasn't tried. No, he hasn't tried yet, no. That's why, that's why it takes him ages, because he forgets how easy it is. It takes him so long. My prophet, may you grant the elders the wisdom to pair me with Edmund. He is strong and capable, tender and kind. I long to bear his children. Oh my god, that's what I say to you. Fucking hell. Ooh, someone wants to get laid. <laughs> yes, Abby is very correct. So, you, you write your wish. You stick it in the fence. And the prophet is supposed to know who wrote the note, despite the fact there's no names on the note. So how do they know, how does she know to hook you guys up if she doesn't... She's just going to be hooking up random guys until there's someone that goes, Thank you! And then the rest of them, they're just going to be screwing all over the place, having children and not being happy about it. This is a very flawed system. God, there's loads of places to go. Um, Oh. I'm not sure if I was supposed to go here, but... Hmm. If there's something coming up later, I'll swap out for a crowbar in a bit. Mm, God, what's in here? Okay. Single screw for Abby. Because that's all she gets. Oh, it's a lucky cat. That's nice. Cam. Thanks for the note. Appreciate it. Can't wait to see you again. Meanwhile, I'm still stuck guarding the Scar Prophet. I didn't tell you this, but on the last shift, I talked to her. I asked her why is she doing this. Why didn't she ask her people to lay down their arms? She started off with the usual Scar BS, how we need to go back to nature, talked a bunch about reliance on machines. But then she said she doesn't want a war. Why are they using guns and shit then? That outbreak day was a wake-up call, but not all of us woke up or something like that. It was just getting interesting when fucking Lewis walks in and gives me shit about talking to her. But when he started screaming at her, she just smiled back at him. Even when they moved her cells and the other guards were calling her names and pushing her around, she just kept that calm smile. It was spooky. Everyone says, but everyone says she's crazy. But I'll tell you. What? After hanging out with her, I get what she's saying. Don't get me wrong, I think her followers are fucking loons. But she has a way without her that draws you in. I hear rumblings that they want to move her to a more secure location. Sorry, I burped. See you back home. Be careful, Sally. And watch out for Lewis. <laughs> yeah, Lewis is quite an aggressive name, actually. Sorry for anyone called Lewis. But if you say it in a particular way, it sounds like you're going to kill someone. It's like, you, it's like you imagine watching a crime documentary. It's like, this teenager murdered his mother by stabbing her eyes with pencils. His name was Lewis. It's just it's just a very murdery teenager kind of name, you know? Wow. But again, I feel like I can say that because I think James is a stupid name as well. James sounds like a, a posh fat pig. Like a, not 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 like a person that is a, I mean a pig, a literal a literal pig that lives in shit. It's like a, a pig pig in a wig. <laughs> That's a James. Hello, I'm James the Pig. It's it's so I hate the name James, and I'm stuck with it. Oh my god! <laughs> it's either James from Team Rocket or it's a pig with a wig on. Like there's there's no no good comes from having the name. 
Yeah, and it's like people would say, oh, what about James Bond? Yeah, have you got any idea how many STDs that motherfucker has? <laughs> he has no way with the ladies or anything. He's not cool. He j what kind of secret agent goes around saying his name? I'm an undercover agent. My name is James Bond. Here's my address. Like, what is the fucking point of James Bond? I don't get it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't get it. There's only so much cockiness I can take, and he has got too much. Oh, shit. Oh, oh. Screws. Nice. That's what James Bond will be doing tonight. I love your name, Karis. It's C E R Y S. It's really cool. It's like so, it's it's like it's like a kind of warlord name. I love it. I I, I guess I haven't lived with it, but no, I've got nothing. <laughs> I haven't no, I haven't lived with it. No, that's fair. That's fair. Thick and awesome. Sixty-eight bits. Hey, Kelly, what's your favorite video game-based movie? Also, you had some banukas too. Did I? Oh, Fushi raided us with 62. Sorry, I, I've missed all of this stuff. Thank you so much for the raid, Fush. Very kind of you. Thanks for bringing all the banukas in. Very kind of you. You were in the middle of me rant ranting about how shit James Bond is. <laughs> Shadow Dragon, 100 bits. Um, I bought Assassin's Creed Odyssey about a month ago. Haven't gotten that far into the game. Did I screw up? I'd watch your review, but I didn't want to leave the stream. It, it's a fine game. It's just another Assassin's Creed game, so do as you want. Screw Lewis, says Classy168 bits. 68 bits from Thick and Awesome. What is your favourite video game-based movie? Yeah, okay. Uh, I don't know, because I don't like watching video game-based movies. And I can't think of... I, I think probably the best quality one is Silent Hill. But I never, ever go out of my way actively to watch a video game movie. Like, I don't care about watching Doom. I don't care about watching um, the other one. I don't care about watching um, uh, Street Fighter. I, I, I just... It's not... Duke Nukem? No, Duke Nukem didn't have a movie. Tomb Raider? Which sucked. That's not a video game movie. It's a comic book character. I don't know. There was the new Tomb Raider, which sucked, and then there were the old Tomb Raider movies, which I don't... I think the first one's got its merits, but they still aren't that great. I don't know, it's because Hollywood doesn't take video games seriously. Which is funny coming from me because I'm always an advocate for not taking games all that seriously. But when it comes to adaptations and the general public perception, yeah, I think more people could look at it, look at it a bit more seriously than they do. If you can watch a fucking soap opera, you can you can understand why people like a video game. That's all I'm saying. Ah, uh, dearie me. Ah, uh, what have we got? Peperona, I said a hundred bits. Hey, my name's Lewis and my middle name is James. I feel offended. Is it really? Is it really? Really? Where's your driving license? Yeah, it is a game, but it's not based on a game. It is a comic book first. I'm sorry, honey. I'm not being patronizing. I said it was a comic book and you said, no, it's a video game. And I said, yes, it was a comic book first, which is what I said before. Not patronizing. Sweet Tooth 201 resub. Thank you so much. Caddy, what about James Potter? James Potter's a cunt. <laughs> There's nothing I've got to say about that. He's awful. I don't like him. Um, at least your name isn't Zach, a name that's misspelled um, every fucking time. I love the name Zach. Iron Ninja. 200 bits from a couple onions. That's religion in a nutshell. I give you over the fence of Xbox 360. Uh, what? I'm very, very confused what you said there, Harper. Um... What what about James the Red Train? He was my favorite. He was a, he was awful as well. He sucked in the show as well. He was the whingiest, ugliest, nastiest one out of all of them. At least your name doesn't sound like a cooking instruction. Wait, who's seeing me? What? Where? I'm sorry. Where are you? Oh, there's a sniper. Fuck's sake. Oh, okay. Oh, fuck me. Okay. Well, this is good. Um, oh, God, leave me alone. Oh, fuck me. Oh. oh. Oh, 
Oh, you motherfucker. Stop moving your stupid bald head. Yeah, that's what you get. Stand up and stare at me and you get killed. Oh. Got ya. Alright, where's this fucking sniper? There you are. Got ya. Alright, probably should heal, shouldn't I? Oh, we've got a bow and arrow. -er. Oh, God, I hate these guys. They're like stalkers, but people. I lost her. Did you? Eyes everywhere. She can't have gone far. Don't try to get There we go, go to sleep. Well done. Good boy. Oh, fuck me. Nothing. We're good. Stand still for a fucking second. Got you. Bye. <laughs> Boy! Oh, dearie me. Thick and awesome, 68 bits. There is James Dean, may he rest in peace. Yeah, I don't know much about James Dean. I know he was alright. I know he was an okay guy, but that's as much as I know. Wait, where's my suppressive? I only got like one shot on it. I bloody have, haven't I? There's my bastard. Where are you? Found you. Found you. Fuck you. I was just about to hit the trigger. Oh, how did that miss? Come now. Now I've got a fucking heal. Which takes time, as the hint screen lovingly told me. Oh, look, the time has been taken. Now, can I please shoot you and get this over with? Jesus Christ, this guy doesn't let up. Oh, my God. I, I, geez, I don't, I'm being, I'm being taken down here. Is it just you that's left? Oh my god, I can't do this. This dude's fucking murdering me. I don't know if, I don't even know if I'm supposed to be shooting him from here. I don't know if I should be like running from cover to cover or what. I... Where the fuck are you? If it turns out you can't shoot this guy because of his position, I'm going to be pissed off. I don't think you can shoot him. I actually don't think you can shoot him. I'll try one more time. One more time. No, you can't. Well, thanks, game. Thanks for doing that. I've wasted all my fucking ammo trying to kill this bastard. Jesus Christ. I don't even think you're the same guy. Maybe you were? Oh, I'm not sure. Shh, quiet. Okay, where 
Where's everyone else? Oh, seeing the light leave their eyes is quite unsettling. Okay. Peeper Oni has cheered 50 bits. I'll DM you my Twitter license if you don't... My license if you don't believe me. <laughs> okay. I don't know if I should call your bluff on that. I'm interested now. I think that's a massive fucking coincidence if your name is just so happens to be Lewis James. And I spent the last five minutes slagging off the name Lewis and James. So there you go. Well, we've been raided by Ashens three minutes ago. Jesus Christ, dude. Thank you so much. Sorry I missed um, the Banuka raid there. I was too busy getting upset with this man that's been shooting at me from a big fucking skyscraper. Uh, where am I? Oh no, there's a doody. Axe in the stomach. Oh. What's shit? What's shit? I think that's pretty good. I thought that was all right. Okay. No, fucking hell. 500 bits from Mongy123. Hi, Kelly. I'm finally able to catch you live. Just wanted to say that I've been going through a really rough time lately. I've discovered you at the right time in my life. Thank you so much. Thank No, thank you for being so kind. Very, very kind of you. Oh, God. Okay, up the stairs we go then. Let's go. Come on, abs. Let's go. Thank you for the 200 bits, Harper Onions. DLC featuring the dog who seeks revenge for his stolen squeaky toy. <laughs> Okay, right. Oh, there you are. Are you going to come this way? Or am I going to have to... Am I going to have to rush you? You did the right thing. Shh. Shh. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. There's nothing. There's nothing bad waiting for you there. Okay, now where do I go? Okay. Gotta be a way through this building. Hmm. Yeah, probably through the door. Anything here? Oh, some rifle ammo. That's great. Just like Frosties. Uh oh. Oh, I thought I could turn the lights on. Ah! Four screws. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> Okay, what's in here? Got another drawer with some bang juice in it. Makes you wonder why you don't just check every single drawer. Why specifically the middle drawer there? Why don't you check the one above it? White paper D. Oh dear. Okay, right. Up one more floor. Turn the light off just in case. Oh, we're not going any higher up. The stairs are now rock. That's that's not that's not happening. Oh, it's someone's house now. Oh, it feels like we shouldn't be here. Oh, damn! This is pretty. Fuck me. Okay. Oh, geez. Fuck. That's exactly what I said. Why, why do you not hope that Omen came this way? That's the way we're going. If you hoped he hadn't come this way, why are we going this way? If there's something waiting on the other end of that that we can't see, I'm gonna laugh. No. That was suck. Okay. Shotgun? Yep, I'm good with a shotgun. This will help. Double barrel shotgun. Nice. Yeah, I've got some rags. And uh, we've got nothing. Oh, just knocked the monitor off there. Jeez. Oh, what's over here? There you are. Just need to get down to the street. Yeah, and then you'll be right there. Get onto the street and you break you're basically at the Ferris wheel. Oh god. 
Oh, hello. Crazy bitch. <laughs> Do you even know what you were starting? Yeah, she was starting something. Just like Michael Jackson was. And that's a good joke What's because it can, be, it can be taken in two different ways. Of course I walked right into a scar camp. Ah, cool. We get to customize our webs. Okay, let's do it. Uh, any more screws that I can screw Change myself with? Around. That was bad. Sorry, I'm not going to... I can't take it back. I'm live. Um, cable. When a child is born to the Seraphites, they're like a blank slate. Nothing but potential. Something that crawls around and shits its pants doesn't have potential. You have fulfilled that potential beyond my wildest expectations. Forgive me not for being present for your initiation ceremony. I remember my own father soothing the sting on my cheeks with eucalyptus. <coughs> eucalyptus leaves soaked in cold rainwater. You will forget the pain in time, but the cuts will always be there to remind you of the wisdom of our prophet. We are imperfect beings and thus make ourselves ourselves imperfect in her eyes has anyone ever realized that she's also a being so she's technically imperfect so none of this makes any fucking sense um may she guide you through the storm of all your days may you always find your true strength i'm so proud of you your father ezra miller oh that's sweet it's freaking awesome thanks for the 68 bits bubble daryl you got a bubble daryl what does that mean Sorry, I don't know what that means. I'm very, I'm very, I'm really sorry. I don't know what that means. Or I'm too tired to think. Baker does, or Baker's dozen, I suppose. Five dollar donation. Abby found the caravan shotgun. Ain't that a kick in the head? Uh... Karish just told me to stop. I thought I had a, I had a thought I had a lovely baritone. I... The world deserves to hear my vibrato, honey. Yeah. Oh! See, it's great, it's flawless. I'm going to give myself a scoop. Give myself a shiny. Everyone remembers the shiny show in the UK. <laughs> so in this case, a shiny is a fucking assault rifle. <laughs> give yourself a shiny. <laughs> Oh, God, the shiny show would have been way better if they started murdering each other. Oh, my God. <laughs> Tibbs has had enough. <laughs> Is it Tiggs or Tibbs? Tig. Tig. I thought it was Tibbs. I could be wrong. Maybe it's Tiggs. I don't know. Mucka Ma dogs oh, being Tiggs? Uh, Tibbs? I don't know. Someone in the chat will know. Uh, maybe. I always like, do I always like dogs be the most. No, di no, Tiggs is the best. No, Dogsby had the best voice. No, Tiggs had the best voice. I don't fucking know. But yeah, if Tiggs has had a... Uh, <laughs> I haven't got any shinies, but I've got... <laughs> I haven't had any shinies, but I've had enough. <laughs> it just blows Mucker in a stupid face. <laughs> I fucking hate that monkey. <laughs> oh my god. No, Mucker was annoying as shit. Yeah. What's this? What's this? It straps on all the floor. <laughs> What's Fire this? Keepers. It's green and I will wear it. <laughs> I'm okay. A long gun holster. Long gun John. Great. Long John gun. Great. That's what we needed. I can view my long John gun. Okay. Awesome. <laughs> Okay, I need to make myself a health kit and I need to give myself a health with the health kit that I just made. That's me explain over explaining it, but you know what I mean. I Ninja, 100 bits. Ezra Miller, as in DCEU Flash, it's Flashpoint really fucked this universe then. I haven't seen any Flash. I don't know. I just know the name Ezra Miller, sorry. Um, Harper Wine is 200 bits. Why do you keep sending 200 bits? You're too nice. Who is the prophet anyway? Ask Karis to sing. We know she can thanks to Snow White and the Seven Clever Boys. Today. <laughs> what do you want Karis to sing, Harper Onions? Oh, hello, Seraphites. I didn't know you were there. Wait, how long does this suppressor last for, then? Three shots. Okay. That makes way more sense. Oh, God, you're coming for me. Grab. 
Yep. Okay, wait. Yep. Yep. And what are you going to do? Hey. What are you going to do? Oh, I wasted my fucking suppressor. No, 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 no. That is not what I needed to do just then. Yeah, I'll attach the silencer when I need it. Oh, now I need it. No, don't do a jump. No. Where'd she go? I'm here. Don't let her slip away. Don't make a sound, I think she said. <laughs> Got ya. Okay, so we've got those two. So where are the rest of them? Oh, there's whistling. There's whistling. Where is the whistling? Oh, they're down there. Hello. What have you got there? Oh, you got a machete. Somebody touch my machete. Okay. Harper one is 200 bits. Anything she likes. And we've also had 50 bits from Mongi123. Now that you're here, I wanted to ask you about how you're feeling about the good old Abby Baton switch. You seem to be having fun with it. Yeah, the gameplay. I don't I don't I don't understand what Abby has to do with anything though. I've got I, I just don't understand this introduction 20 hours into the game. If it was going alongside Ellie, then yeah, but this is just out of nowhere. The I had enough development and understanding of and sympathy for her character. Playing her from the start and doing all of that shit. I, I, I had enough. I didn't need to do this as Abby. Gameplay's great. I just don't I don't see the point of doing it as Abby, that's all. Making a harpoon now. So everyone can fuck off. So yeah, honey, anything you like, go sing something. Um... Oh, stop whistling. Give me inspiration, she says. Oh, I don't know, honey. Um, um, a sea shanty. <laughs> Who's firing at me? Oh, you. Okay. Oh, what are you gonna do now? I've got a shotgun. <laughs> Where are you? Oh, hello. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Oh, my God. That was nasty. Yeah, he was... It was so nasty, he kept screaming even when his head came off. What the fuck? That was horrible. Oh, stop whistling, please. No. I'm going to run at you with my harpoon. How are you going to like that? Go! Oh, shit. Go, shit. Go. No, okay, that didn't work. That really didn't work. Okay, you asked for it. Bye. Oh, Jesus Christ almighty. Get the fuck away. Okay, okay. Uh... Oh, I've got my light on. Well, that doesn't help, does it? Um... Oh, God, they're everywhere. Oh, stop your stupid bloody whistling. Ah! No! No, 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 no! Okay, so I've been cornered. Okay, I need to get rid of one of them, but I don't know who. Heal up, heal up, heal up, heal up. Okay, you're coming. Fuck. You're shooting a wooden plank. Okay, that was pretty badly handled. That's probably the worst handled fight I've done in the entire game so far, but I got through it, and that's all that matters. Oh, God. Yes! Oh, God, now what? Where do you guys keep coming from? 
Is there a Seraphite factory around here? You'd better run. I'm not running. I'm right here. And I've got a mallet, bitch! Oh! Sorry, that was actually quite nasty. Okay. Ugh. Pepperoni, 50 bits. I tagged your Twitter handle in a tweet with my license. Hopefully I called your bluff. No, you fucking... No, you didn't. I don't buy it. Oh, my God. I'm going to need to look. Okay, for anyone... Okay, no, I'm going to... I have to look up because he's tagged me. Okay, so for anyone that um is out of the loop... Earlier on, I was just making a big old stupid bitchy rant about um the name Lewis and the name James because Lewis sounded like a, a teenage serial killer's name and James is either Team Rocket from Pokemon or a um or a, um, a fat pig with a wig on like an actual <laughs> pig or James Bond who has a, a million STDs and goes around as a secret agent telling everybody his full name so a bit of an idiot so someone in the chat said my name is Lewis James Smith and I didn't believe him and um holy fucking shit I've I my bluff has been called. It's been called. I can't believe it. I don't feel bad. It's even funnier because I can't believe that the, the what are the chances? What are the chances? Oh, and I just jumped into the the chat and I see Angelica Carax. I'm a hungry girl tonight. What are you talking about? Oh, your dinner. Taking messages out of context like that does not help. Um, is Ficken Awesome 41 bits? Um, have You haven't gotten a super huge cheer this stream yet. Who do you think will drop it this time? I've got, well, I've had loads of cheers from Harper Onions and I had like a, a 1,500 bit cheer earlier. So yeah, I think I've had some big cheers. Lewis James Smith. What a fucker. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Can't believe it. You don't feel a bit bad. No, because I, I made fun of my name too. So I'm fine. Right. I think that was fair game. Well, Smith is kind of like the standard every man, like, you know, <laughs> I'm just any reason, any, any reason. I need more rags. I haven't got any health kits. I'm going to die. Oh. Oh, some ammo. That's, that's good. No, that's not how you reload. I forgot. <laughs> Harper Onions asks with 150 bits, Karis, do you know the Wombles, the? Hate she hates the Wombles, I'm afraid. Um, she's not very good with puppets. Why don't you sing, um, do you want to build a snowman in your princess, do a Disney princess voice? Yes. Because then you're not technically singing. Elsa? <laughs> oh, you don't want. She's shy. It's okay. I'll start then. Do you want to build a snowman? <laughs> no? Okay. I was starting the song for you. Yeah, do you want to build a snowman? <laughs> oh, yeah, Keris was going to do the clicker noise. Do you want to come over and do that? Yeah. Classy 168 bits. Does that mean you don't like the Muppets? Yeah, she doesn't like the Muppets. She doesn't like puppets and, like, soft, felty things that, that talk with mouths like this. Postman Pat. But she likes Bertha, which is weird because it's exactly the same studio and the same puppets. But, you know, whatever. I'm not going to get into technicalities. Okay, I'm going to move the microphone off screen for a second. Because um, Karis is going to do her clicker noise. That was it. I think it's pretty good. <laughs> Hollow Knight says Karis is anti-Elmo. I think I think even Sesame Street fans are anti Elmo. I think okay, everyone loves Cookie Monster.
I think what happened was um, every single one of the people that I alerted were actually on all of these floors. So this battle was supposed to be a multi-layered hide-and-seek match, but I ended up just bringing them all to one room and murdering them all. I think that's what happened here. That's what it looks like anyway. Okay, we've been up here, haven't we? No, we haven't. Oh god, there's so much to find. Um... this bottle. No, I have been up here. Right, okay. <laughs> Hollow Knight, that genuinely freaked me out. That was, uh, that was a good clicker noise. And completely off subject, Alex the Z-Man says, I'm a die-hard bird lover. <laughs> a die-hard bird lover. <laughs> G, okay, Harper at Wanyans with 200 bits again, thank you, says, G, she must hate Arlo. I don't think you hate Arlo. Arlo's... Um, I showed you a video of his before. He's the blue puppet guy that does the game stuff on YouTube. I think he's very cuddly. Yeah, it... I mean, it's not like an absolute... It's not a phobia. She's flexible with her I'm felt. Flex <laughs> I have a flexible phobia. Yeah. Yeah, pa Postman Pat actually makes her physically sick. So, like, her body just is outright irrational fear, hyper hyperspace, like... Why did she chase you around TK Maxx with a Postman Pat doll? It's probably why you hate her. <laughs> hate him, rather, not hate her. Okay, I think I've got to go back up, haven't I? Um... Peeperoni, thank you so much. Take the last of my bits, bro, for the barrel of last you brought me in my other half. Thank you so much, Peeperoni. Have some pepperoni. Hmm. Oh, where the fuck am I going? Do I go down here? Uh, ah, here we go. Right, well, I'll check this floor then, just to be safe. I don't think there is anything down here. So I had to go to the lower floor. Interesting. Okay, right. Let's head out the back. Oh, hang on. I'm lost. Oh, no. I'm here. Okay. I'm not lost anymore. Yay. Just get down to the street. Oh, yes. And then I'm basically at the Ferris wheel, aren't I? Oh, hello. Don't do that. We've only just met. Am I pressing a button? Yes, I am. Yeah, okay. Oh! Ah! I mean, fair play, but... Ow! No, I'm, I think I'm stuck. Oof. Ow. Oh, dear. 100 bits inflamed. Thanks for the stream, Caddy. I've got to go now, so I'll catch the rest as a VOD. Thank you so much. Four months earlier. Gee, what the fuck? Why are we doing this? Owen. Owen! I haven't forgotten who Ellie is. I just don't see the relevance of any of this. Hey. Is everything all right? Is this where she's going to ask him out? Is this a bad time? No, no. This is a bad time. It's the apocalypse. It's a bad time every second of every day. So, what's up? We got orders? Sort of. Sort of. You know what? Just, how about we hold off on the Ibis talk? For just a minute. Oh, and... When's the last time you were here? Look around. Take it all in. What did you do? Uh, you know, just rip out. Well, hold on. Is Alice out here? She's out with Mel. Aww. Oh, this is pure. This is immersive gaming in 2020, everybody. Look at that. Unresponsive motion controls. Let's squeak. 
Oh god, the eyes come out. You guys doing okay? Getting nice. Good. I'm gonna just make this uh, an inappropriate conversation. For the most part, yeah, I mean, she can be really sweet. Must feel nice after me. Well, you got badass exterior. Oh, I was enjoying that. You have a bad memory. So it's freaking awesome. 95 bits here. Thank you. Unfortunately, I've got to miss the rest of the stream. Have a um, have a hard time sleeping, so I'm gonna try heading to bed early. Put the stream on in the background. Listen to my sultry voice. Anyway, but hey, thank you. Thanks for coming down. Hope you enjoyed You're yourself. Painting over Max's mural. I'm embellishing it. Oh, you've really moved up from graffiti and firefly tags. Oh, did you hear another firefly join last month? Ex firefly. Well, she'd also heard about a regroup in Santa Barbara. Was there any proof to go along with that rumor? No. How about that? <laughs> Hello, fire. Can you sign me in, please? I've got a meeting. Oh, God. Yeah, we need to play some bow. What's this? Oh, yeah. Mel and I have this competition thing going. Well, I, I don't think you would enjoy it. It's pretty complicated. I see what you're doing, and it's working. What do I do? Okay. See those targets? Yeah. Just hit as many as you can before the time's up. I win? You better write my name up there. You got it. Okay, let's see if I can do it. That's one. Yeah. Proud of you. Fuck. Two down. And more to go. Good for you. Shit. Got to remember with bow. Got him a bit higher. Holy <laughs> shit. Five. Halfway there, Ab. Two to beat me. No pressure. Actually, very proud right now. Holy shit! You did it! You got the high score. Yeah, I did. I've still got time left, right? Yeah, but. <laughs> then I'm not done. Oh my god! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just ten seconds left. Oh, Five, that didn't count. <laughs> four, three, two. One. Oh, I can't hit you in the head. Oh, that would have been funny. I did it. <laughs> First try. How do you like me now? Yeah. PG Thanks. Scott donated ten dollars. Thank you so much. Shut Stopping up. by my recording break just here to send you oh. some love. Thank you so much, yeah. dude. Are you scared of Mel finding out I was here? No. <laughs> she doesn't care. So put me up on the board, Owen. All right. That is ridiculously oh, kind of you. Thanks for the donation. You really didn't need to do that. Thank you. Get a trophy for that? Yeah, I do. I want you to see. Come upstairs. Is it that boat captain's body? Because I saw it last time. You didn't put a Santa hat on it, did you? What? No. That would actually be kind of cool. <laughs> This is even cooler. Come on. Can I ask? Recording break from what? Sorry, I was just I was I was getting into the story just then. Recording break from what? I'm interested. After you. What is all this? Festive. Oh wow. This is cool. Jesus, this is nicer than most people's houses I've seen at Christmas time. <laughs> Well, have you 
is nice. Oh, whatever. Philistine. You want me to lie? Yes. Obviously. Thank you, CB Zombies, for the subscription. Very kind of you. Honey, can I ask a huge favor? Can you get me some water, uh, please? She's into this uh, kiss? Christmas thing. And, uh, it's okay. Yeah. It's Thanks. One year, so. 150 bits from Harper Onions. Well, that's my I career in the pan. I want to be stopped by animator here. You can go fuck yourself. Yeah, sorry no, about that, dude. She likes stop motion. It's pup. It's happy. specific kinds of puppets. You don't deserve one. And for some reason, Postman Pat's just one of those puppets. There's someone who loves me. No, she loves. She loves like Henry Selleck movies and um, Tim Burton stop motion Why and all that kind of stuff. Good I think it's Am I? Babies. It's baby puppets, she says. Like puppets for Thank you. Yeah. Uh, you blow off training tonight. Abby, when the moon comes I out. found Joel's brother. He's at a settlement out in Wyoming. How do you know that? Because the Fireflies who served with him got picked up at the wall. I thought he quit like a decade ago. Yeah. So, have these guys heard from him since? It's a lead. I gotta see it through. And then they head no, off to the mountains, and then this is when... You do find him. He might not know where Joel is. Yeah, and they just so happen to be together. Did you tell the others? Everyone's on board. Thank you, Angelica no, Rax, for the 100 bits. So the Key Brothers are right out for her. I don't know the Key Brothers. Isaac's never going to let that many people go off. I know it's probably going to piss off a lot of people, and I probably have seen Bullshit. a Key Brothers thing. I've never heard Who's of Key Brothers, sorry. Than Isaac? He knows what Joel's done. Hey. We're doing this together, right? Thank you, CB Zombies, for the very kind words. I won't read them out because I'm in the middle of a cutscene, but thank you. Very kind of you. Glad you could make it down. And PG Scott is recording a song. Oh, what kind of song? Like, opera? Mm -hmm. Metal? Pop? R&B? Let me know. Are oh, we back with Ellie now? Oh, have we... Abby's been knocked out. Welcoming committee. Okay, we're being hung. Um, uh, okay, we're we're being we're being hung. Okay. How does this help convert anybody? This is what I want to know. <laughs> yeah, this is cult leader. They are nested with sin. Free them. Oh. They may know my... the other apostate. 
clip her wings. What does that mean? Oh fucking hell. Ah! Oh! Okay, I figured someone would have screamed a lot louder from doing that from doing that to someone's arms, but I don't know. Tony Kubis is asking, can you swing on the noose with your neck and not die? No, you would eventually lose, you'd eventually suffocate. It's arguably wor the worse way to go. Because at, at least if you're dropped, your neck breaks. But if you're left to hang, you're losing oxygen. And you could be there for a few days. You could, you know, there's like a million different things. Demons are coming. Cut her down. She's one of them. Lev. Oh, the redness of the face is there. Thank you for the 481 bits of this Rayto 6. Oh shit, it's one of my favorite characters. Live, baby. Hope you're still having fun with the game. I am. Watch I'm not backs. understanding the whole Abby subplot 20 hours into the fucking game. I mean, I, I get it. I understand it, but. Oh shit, I thought it was a cutscene. These guys don't look too good for comfort. I'm being ganged. Damn it, I'm out. <sighs> Fuck. Yeah, I do know that I was doing that. I just didn't do it very well, game. And I thought that this, I thought this was a cutscene. So I took a few cheap shots anyway. Visuals, dude. God, are these like woodland creature specific infected? These are quite freaky. Let's go show how good the lighting engine is, though, because that's making them look extra freaky. And then pick up that. No? Okay. Oh, fuck. I don't think punching them is going to do much, but okay, I haven't got anything else. I would love to, but I'm being pummeled in a corner right now.
I guess she does have the arms for it. That was the last of them. Was it? You two okay? I hope so. Yeah. We have to keep moving before more come. Every direction looks the same. <laughs> If one of them at some point in this game said the last of us, then I, I would, like, lose my mind. Yeah, I'm on death's door, so we need to get out of here. Yeah, this lighting makes those enemies freaky just on their own. They probably don't look that much different from regular infected, but that lighting's doing such a good job at making them look horrible. Yeah, we're going in. No? Okay. Oh, what is here with the open oh, faces? Is there another way around? The there fuck is going on? Oh, hell, thank Come God. On. Yes, let's eat the food on the floor of this dank and dirty rotting sewer pit. Move. Um, oh, honey. Have you got the controller remote? Controller room. Yes, you know what I mean. Well, now I've lost my game. You've lost your game? Why? Go. Well, it's nice that you've lost a game. I still haven't won a game of Tetris 99 yet. Oh, you don't do that. They saved my life. Get away from them, you bastard! Oh, it's Miss Trunchbull. It is. You are you wearing my backpack? Yeah, are you wearing my fist in your face? Oh fuck. She's... Yeah, this isn't gonna end well. Oh, fuck my ass. What the hell? Oh. Miss Trunchbull's face got caved in. I don't remember that bit of Matilda. Nasty. Um, oh, I guess, uh, yeah, if I can't use both those hammers, are both the same amount of, um, what's the word? Um, durability left, so not much point in not doing that. I bet you if Matilda honed her, her psychic power, she could make people's heads explode. Go on. Oh, a golden gun? Yeah, it is a James Bond. Are you, f you need supplies. Hunting I'm pistol. Yet. Pun fucking intended. What's a pun? Mm. Oh god, I've got to start all again from... Oh no, mate, it's because I had my, um... I used my last bits of screws on my scope, didn't I? I've never seen scars going after scars before. Seraphites. What the hell did you do? I shaved my head. Fine, don't tell me. I really don't care. I'm just looking around for some bits and bobs. Uh, I think we're good. Okay, right. Oh. Awesome. Right, let's see if I can... First of all, I need to craft myself a healing kit, like, right now. Um... No, I won't waste that. Um... 
Can I make myself any, uh... Yeah, shivs would be quite useful. Let's do that. Yeah, I'm always finding scissors and rags and shit. Right, let's heal up. Okay. What can I go for? Shotgun stability. Recoil on the handgun would be pretty useful. Yeah, let's go for handgun recoil. Any recoil is... Yeah. Awesome. I do love how when you're upgrading the weapons, you get to see every bit and piece of, like, the gun being dismantled and put back together and everything. That's, that's pretty cool att attention to detail. I was going to say attention to dental. Yeah, those shivs were probably a good idea. I'm always finding scissors and stuff, but I'm full and I can't carry them. Eddie, hope you're good today. Oh, hope to God you're okay. The latest truce has fallen apart. We've been ordered back home for reassignments. I've sent two search parties to look for you to no avail. Please find this note okay and come find us. Fuck these scars, Matt. <laughs> I'll be I'll be waiting at the floor by the door. <sighs> oh, I found a book. Bring your own bullets. BYOB! Why do they always there the bar? Oh, supplements, baby! Supplements for my arms! I haven't done my my hourly arm workout yet. These supplements are going to help. Yeah. Well done. Well, you just have to get the weight. Yeah, I know. But you'll get there. And actually, when I first met you, you had your baby arm. Your one incredibly muscly arm from holding babies in a rocking formation while doing other things with your other hand. Yeah. It was quite impressive. Yeah. Oh! I probably should have saved that health kit. Oh, no, there's one there. Thank God. You okay, Stan? Good boy. I know. Dry throat sucks. Okay, sorry. I'm just... I, I just jumped into the chat really quickly. Um, and... I just saw this message here, and I actually am very interested about it, so I am going to read it out. It's from CB Zombies. Hey, Caddy, this is a random thing, but do you have any tips on how to make a good impression on a date? I've met this lady. I think we're getting on great, but I wonder if you've had any words of wisdom. I know it's random. That is random. Um, and it's very cute, and I'm happy for you. Um, be yourself, dude. Be yourself. Or lady. Sorry, I didn't know who it was. Um, but yeah, just be yourself. Yeah, you don't need to... Like, the thing is, if you try, then you've got to keep on trying. Like, every day. Because if you're not yourself from day one, then you're not... You're never going to be yourself. If you're not yourself and you win the heart of somebody, then they're going to expect... They, they've, you've won the heart of the person that thought you were the person you were trying to be. So then that means you're just going to have to keep trying every day for the rest of your life while the relationship's going. You need someone to love you for who you are. I mean, there's a difference between trying too hard and making an effort. Make an effort, absolutely. But you don't need to try so hard. Just be yourself. And if it works out brilliant, that means you don't have to then worry yourself every single second your personality changes when you're upset or whatever. And then if it doesn't work, so what? There's 7 billion people on the planet. We're almost to the coast. Just a little farther. What, if it doesn't work out? So, well, you know, there's other fish in the sea. That's what they say, isn't it? What? Oh. 
Oh, a demon? No! Um, okay. There's a demon, okay. Oh, yeah, I can craft another one of these. Awesome. Okay, right, let's maybe get my shotgun out. I feel a bit safer with that. I'm in the dark, in the rain, being jumped out from every corner. Yeah, that's why I want my shotgun. And it also does some disgusting things to the faces of the things I shoot. Oh my god. Oh. oh, so good. Oh, fucking hell, you scared the fuck out of me. How dare you, Baldy? How dare you? Oh my god. Oh, okay. Oh, Kitty Girl is asking why... Oh, no, no, she didn't get bitten. No, the lady holding her arm. No, it got hammered in. Some nice cultists took her arm and a hammer and then just fucking went to town on her arm. It wasn't very nice. So we responded by throwing the hammer into the guys' faces. Let's see how they liked it. Spoiler alert, they didn't like it. Well, it's got to be something over here. Oh, yeah. Awesome. And I will upgrade that as well. Okay. Uh... Oh, I don't want to... I don't want to put myself into a situation I can't get out from, but then I have got a shotgun. I should be okay. Okay. Jesus, don't you fucking... S you guys need to stop. Look alive. Oh, fuck. Got ya. Doing this in the dark is not fun. Like, at all. Now what? Quite confident it's this way. Quite confident. Look, it's better than not being confident at all. You, you, like, what other choice have you got? Let's just, let's just get out of here. There was something in there and I accidentally shut the drawer and I can't open it again. Shit. Oh, whoopsie. Oh, yeah, Chalky Bars. Because as we all know, when the apocalypse happens, the only thing that will be left is Mars Bars. Mm. Let's refuel that. I can't make a suppressor. That's annoying, but whatever. Oh, yeah, I've got my hunting pistol, haven't I? I don't know what that's supposed to do exactly, but... Well, shoot things, I know, but I don't know what major difference this has over anything else I have. Okay, got some doors there. Okay, should we go through here, see what's hiding? More um, alcohol, which I don't need. Ammo, great. Screws. Okay, out we go. Let's go through the doors then. In which case I'm going to swap that out for my handgun because I've got more ammo on that. Equip my shotgun. And hope for the worst. Prepare for the worst, open rather. Gate, right? we'll open it. Come on. Your turn. Watch that arm. Oh, 
Oh, come on. Oh, this isn't fun. This is not fun. This is not fun. I'm just going to go into a corner and take them all out as they as they come. Oh, no, that didn't work. That plan was a bad one. Ah! Uh, Can't see! Can't see! Oh god, there's a clicker! There's a clicker! Another one! Get through the fucking... Pipe bombs, pipe bombs, pipe bombs, go! Bang! That didn't work, fuck! Through here, again! Okay, that should do it. How's it going out there? It's still going! Oh my god! Where are you two? I have never s oh shit, I just wasted a pipe bomb. I can't believe I trusted scars. Alright, heal pack. I have never seen a clicker do that. I don't know if that's new in this game, but that was quite horrifying. Oh god, there's more of them. Fuck me. Jeez. Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, I haven't got time for you either. Okay, this sounds like a bad one. Oh, shit. Ah, no, there's two of them. Are you shitting me? Get out! Where are- where am I? I can't even see where I am, fuck. Uh. Okay, right. Shotgun. Ah. Oh shit. Jesus Christ, I can't fucking see! And here are the fucking big guys. Get out, get out, get out! I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die! Fucking run, run! Just 
go, just go, just go, just go. Craft a bomb, quickly. That wasn't fun. God, worked up a sweat there. Jesus Christ. Just give me a minute. You're gonna hold on tight. I was hoping to do that on one go, but I guess second try is not too bad. Nice and steady. In and out. Okay, if I had no, if I like. Luckily, I've had I had a lot of stuff ready to go. That I mean, that's I guess that's the case with survival horror, isn't it? Like, if you don't have Try the, the shit ready, sure no then yeah, you are gonna die broken. most of the time. But if you didn't Try have just if you didn't have just as much as what I did just then, that probably would have been the hardest pit of the game for you. Luckily, I had Any quite options? a fair bit. No. Let's get inside before someone sees. Okay. Lock it. strips. Lean back. Oh. Okay. I'm gonna move it, okay? Oh, this is gonna be nice. You ready? I thought she was gonna like shove it in the arm. Oh. Thanks for cutting me down. Sarah gets a lot of traffic. Whatever shape she's in, we need to get out of here by tomorrow. We'll be fine. Yeah. Well, that happened. Right, so what what have I got left of my myself? I make some pipe bombs. Ah, yes, incendiary shells. That sounds good. Yeah, let's do it. Awesome. Yeah, set things on fire and blow them up, save them for bosses. I think that's a good idea. 
forget I have a scope on this fucking thing. I saved up all my bloody nuts and bolts for it. Ah. Okay. All right. Owen. That's lovely, honey. I can't comment. I can't comment. I've been making right bodily noises all this the whole time. No, it's because of the food. Well, we know sweet corn is as well. Okay. Hmm. Through the door. Anything in here? Uh -huh. I don't think so. Uh, crafting desk, any screws? Yep, one, two, three, four, 50 million. Okay, great, cool. Let's make some guns. And not the ones on my arms. Uh, capacity on the handgun, stability on that. Long range with high damage and slow reload speed. So it's technically like a sniper rifle, I suppose. Oh, Stan just went straight over the wires because there's food on the other end. Wow, what a bitch. He wants the yogurt pot. Fucking dog. I guess the reload speed on this thing would probably be useful. But then I'm using the handgun quite a lot. Um, stability. Capacity and stability. No, just stability. That's good with me. Hey, Godo. Thanks for the 100 bits. Nice to see you. Something that's potentially not Twitch friendly is coming up soon. Keep an eye on chat before entering a cutscene. Someone may tell you when it's coming. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Um, I don't know. I, I guess I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to be taken down. Yeah, I know, but there are still some things that you can't show on Twitch. Oh, okay. okay, thanks for letting me know, dude. That's very, very, very kind of you. Um, I'll keep my eye on the chat. Don't spoil it, anybody, but I think what I'll do just to save my ass is to go into intermission mode for that one bit, and then we'll come straight back after it's over. Well, I don't know. Everyone's going to... Oh no, I'll be fine. It's not, no, they're not talking about me being, having a problem. They're talking about Twitch having a problem. I don't know the ins and outs of Twitch yet. Yeah, no, oh no, I, I've got, I've got no problem with gore or like any kind of violence uh, that, that extends to that. But I'm just saying that if Twitch doesn't like it and gets me banned for a little bit, I don't want that shit either. So I, uh, yeah, I'm going to be, I'm going to be careful. Yeah, that's the problem, yeah. Yeah, that's the problem with live streaming at the moment. They haven't quite figured that out yet. Oh! Hmm, okay. So we've got one clicker, two clickers. I think that's just an, a regular one. No, I don't need to do a shift kill. Okay, right. Ah, it's a clicks. Okay, right. Which way is it going? Is it coming towards me? Another turn around. Oh, 
Oh, that's so unsettling. Uh, okay, where are you going? Back the way you came. Great. No, nope, you're coming this way. Okay. Oh, fuck. Okay. I'm just going to let you do your thing. Let you do your patrol. And I'll come up behind you. Okay, cool. Why? Hey, what? Oh god, they're running around the bloody boxes. Ah! Yeah, we've got stalkers now. Who don't like to show up on your listening thing until they're already moving, by which point you're already there. Yeah. Me? Yeah, I'm alright. I just hate stalkers. They're like a cross between a clicker and a runner. So they hide, they run and hide. Oh my god, there's one there. Jesus, loads. I don't know what I'm going to do. Or is that the same one, but it just came up a different way? I'm going to just heal up. Can I just go around in circles? That'd be nice. Yeah, I can. Wow, that was that was fun. There's a load. Okay. No, get off me. Get off me. Purple Sloth Zero, 100 bit cheer, thank you so much. So, are you relatively new to streaming? I've, appara I've apparently been following this account since 2016. Only recently noticed you actually stream on here, lol. Yes. Um, I started streaming when it became. when it started getting high traction and attention. But at the time, three videos a week and everything, I didn't have time. Um, and I didn't have time to learn how to use it. And all the games I wanted to play, I wanted to review, which meant having to capture the footage as well as stream it, which I couldn't do because I didn't have the budget to do that. So there were a load of a load of factors as to why I stopped doing it. Um, still trying to build the YouTube audience, so I didn't want to... But, but then, you know, this has now been my career for a few years now, and I can tell you that putting all your eggs in the YouTube basket is not is not useful. It's not handy. It's not smart. And I've been wanting to stream for ages because there's so many games that come out and I can only do videos about so many of them. So I figured, well, how about I start streaming a load of them and then that means 
I can play them in my spare time while sharing it with you guys. While hopefully being and kind of entertaining. Oh god, you're so creepy. I think that was the last one, but I'm not sure. Done. Yeah, okay. Right. No sunset to follow. At least there's a Ferris wheel. Yeah, I've been working, like, I've been building the channel to work it up to a point where I could upload less, but make way higher. Because in order to keep my channel sustained for years, I had to upload once a week, which was murdering me slowly. And that was before, that, that was even after I was uploading three times a week, which was also murdering me, but... Um, it's just got harder and harder and harder. And I was like, look, I want to talk about new games and I want to give you my opinions and thoughts on them. So why don't I bring up the streaming channel back so that I can do that while I'm playing the game live for you guys. Have an interactive thing back and forth and shit. And, um, yeah, keep it going alongside the YouTube thing just in case YouTube implodes and I've got nothing else to my name. At least I've got Twitch, right? So yeah, I'm, I'm not like brand new. I have been going for a few months now, but um, I'm still learning quite a lot. It's a completely different world to YouTube. I'll just say that. It took me a good, like uh, last time I had time off, I, ha I used all that time off. It took me about two to three weeks to learn the ins and outs of Streamlabs and how Twitch works and bit rates and like everything. Delays um, with capture cards and stuff. Like there's been, there's so much. Levels that you need to get, alerts you need to get right, layouts on the stream. There's so much to do and to get right. I just never had the time to figure it all out. And at the time, it wouldn't have been worth my time, unfortunately, to figure all that out back in the past. Because I would have lost, like, the only money I was making to keep my family alive trying to work out Twitch. I would have been making a giant risk. Oh. Maybe I shouldn't have gone that way. Fuck. Now what? Oh, that was something else as well. So, the last time I streamed before I stopped for a good, like, six years was, um... If I'm right in thinking, it was a Crash Bandicoot Marathon stream I did um, in my old flat. So this was a... Yeah, I think that was the last time I streamed before I stopped. And I did like a good six hour stream. I played Crash Bandicoot 1, 2 and 3 back to back. I didn't do them 100%. I just finished the main games. I did them back to back. Am I supposed to be diving into this or what? It's not letting me climb up here, so... Uh, okay. I guess that's where I'm going. And, um, yeah, what ended up happening was that I'd used all that time. I'd built up quite a lot of hype on my YouTube channel. Um, I had a really good, t like, I had a few thousand people, I think. Like, I really hyped it up on the YouTube channel so everyone knew it was happening. And then, like, at the end of the whole session, everything considered... I like. I, I can't. Mem I can't. I made like thirty dollars or something, and obviously you shouldn't be doing it for the money. But the problem is, is that that was my like YouTube was my only source of income, and I wasn't making that much, and I needed to like balance my time out properly. And it was like that was six hours. I could have had another video done, and I could have sustained my life living in the flat. And yeah, well, I was starting to think about living with Keris and the family, and I was still saving up for that. So it just wasn't, it wasn't like um, time, it wasn't time friendly to me and it wasn't, um, um, what's the, not, what's the word? Um, uh, not financially beneficial, fi financially stable, I guess. No, I, I don't know. It just, it, it, like nothing worked out. Viable. Viable. Thank you. That's the word. Yeah. And it was, yeah, of course it was different then. Of course, oh, sorry. It was different then. Yeah, absolutely. 
Will, I'm going to crash. Stop writing your letter then. Despite the adrenaline of this whole shit storm, this flu thing is kicking my ass. Please let me catch a few hours sleep so I can fight this thing. I cradle our little bee and put her to sleep. I think she's pretty shaken up by the violence of it all. She asked, Mummy, why did you and Daddy push all those people? I told her it was because it was the only way for guests to get on board. She nodded, but I don't think she fully comprehends. Oh, God. Maybe I should have said something different. I don't know. Anyways, if she wakes up before me, read some of her books with her. That seems to calm her down. Hopefully you'll be able to get the ration situation sorted out. Love you, Quinn. Oh, Jesus. So all these people didn't live. That's that's very jolly. Black Flame six nine nine in the chat is asking, "Why are you awake, Caddy? It's ten past one." Yeah, you seem to you don't seem to understand YouTube life. <laughs> My bedtime is on average about two or three in the morning because I'm busy recording footage for videos or editing videos or doing streams. It's a busy life. But also because, like, I know I've got quite a large American fan base and they, this is probably the only chance they'll get to see me because of the time differences and everything. And Australia as well. Oh, what's on the other end of this door? Crossbow, sweet. So I'm assuming this means silent weapon, which means I'm going to... Hmm. Oh, okay. Oh, fuck. I was expecting there to be a little bit of a pullback. Is that... Well, considering that there's... There doesn't seem to be any indication on the reticle that the arrow will drop like what with the sniper rifle there's a reticle that shows you how far the bullet will drop and the same goes on the bow and out or like when you're aiming so maybe it's just that fast it will aim and shoot exactly where i need it to let's see i won't compensate my distance or my height no just goes in a straight line sweet that makes things quite simple actually great I think I might like this crossbow. Can't collect the arrows after I've used them though. That's fine. I can cope with that. Uh. Oh, they can be recovered more frequently than bow and arrows. Well, I oh, is that one that I recovered? Oh, I didn't realize. Okay, sweet. That makes it even better. Okay, thank you for your help with that infected passenger. We're lucky to have someone on your training a grit on board. My crewmates were useless, and I don't agree with the captain keeping the weapons locked away. We can't willfully ignorant that we have infected passengers on board this ferry. Weapon storage on the after top deck combo 907701. Can I remember that? No. Your crossbow is in there. I trust you on this. Okay, so that must have been the guy that was holding the crossbow. 997701. Okay, all right. Yeah, there are some weapons, like the sniper rifle, because it's long distance, and the bow and arrow, because human power can only do so much. There's there's a, like a little, on the reticle, there's a little dropping kind of ladder reticle underneath it to show you, to give you an idea of where how high you should be aiming above your target for the arrow to hit. But with this, I guess the bullets are that fast that you don't need to worry about it, which is great. All right, if I can stealth kill you... That would be great, um, but then I think everyone else will see me. Oh, that was close, wasn't it, gents? Oh. Fuck. That was bad. That was really bad. That was really, really bad. Oh, fuck. Fuck, fuck. Uh... Uh shit Oh my god, I keep fucking missing. Oh my god, that's it. I fucked it. That was all my stealth shots all gone. Good fun, eh? 
I don't know which one's the clicker now. I think I've chased it away. Stay here. Don't go any further. Fuck you. Can I pick up those arrows? Or have I completely screwed this up? I suppose I could do the old throw the bottle in the middle and then throw a pipe bomb trick. Yikes! Let's try that. Nice. Okay. This is where things get interesting. Okay. Okay, they're right there. Anyone else? I think it's just you. I'm... Ugh. Wait, what can I craft right now? Shivs. Yeah, I'll craft a shiv. Ooh. Okay, right. Oh, great. Arrows. I wonder if the other one's dropped over here somewhere. Yeah! Don't need to make those noises. You really don't need to make those noises. It's fine. Oh, I think I've lost those other arrows. Fuck. Okay, it's alright. I can still save this. Oh, it's another clicker. Okay. Oh, you bastard! You moved your head at the last fucking minute! Oh, I'm just gonna keep wasting my bullets if I fuck around with this. I'm just, I think I'm just gonna go for it. At least if I wake everybody up. I know where I stand if I wake everybody up. Oh, hello! Where did you come from? Okay, well, they've buggered off over there, so that's fun. Are they going to come back? Ah, secret room. Nice. Well, not secret room, but you know what I mean. It's a room that I'm safe in if I keep quiet. I'll craft a silencer. Fucking great. Rifle out. It's probably the safest thing for me to do. Oh, sorry. Sorry, door. Come on. Coming in. Thank you. Coming down this way. Can I stealth kill you? Awesome. Alright, take you around the corner. And go to sleep. Manic Realms, thank you for the 1,000 bit cheer. Caddy, you're amazing. Loved you since I heard your sweet tones on Did You Know Gaming videos on Crash. I'm glad I can catch your stream out here at Pacific 5pm. I enjoyed this game. Hope you're enjoying yourself. Thank you so much. That was a long time. I think that was 2013 I did that for Did You Know Gaming. Jeez, I hadn't even met him yet. I hadn't even met Shane yet. Jeez, thank you so much for sticking with me that long. And I, I can't even stand my voiceovers from back then. Like, the way I edited them and everything, like, I was way too... 
I don't know. It, 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 it's a different person. It's a different person. I was way too overexcited. Way too, like, the, the voiceover quality is terrible because I was over-compressing everything on the mic. So it's like, it's really, really heavy on the compression, which it didn't need to be. Uh, but I'm glad that that was enough to convince you to stick with me. <laughs> oh. Oh, there they are. There they are. My lovely friend. Till the end. <laughs> no. Right, what have we got over here on the seats? <sighs> Shit. Are you coming down this way? Or am I coming up behind you? What am I doing? Come on, tell me. Got ya. And stealth kill. I sorted it out. I'm guessing that my way out is through the back of the ship, but I'm just gonna search around. Never know what you're gonna find on a seat. You know what people like to leave behind on buses and shit. Oh, if Godo's still in the chat. Um, oh, he is. I think that's how I discovered you two. It was right before Bloodborne launched. Oh god, that was 2015. Jeez. Thanks for sticking with me for so long. Okay, so Godo, you're in the chat. Um, can you quickly tell me, am I close to this? Because I, I don't know how long I should be. I, I should keep streaming for because it is getting late for me. So, should I keep streaming until this, this, um, not supposed to be seen cutscene from Twitch? Or should I, am I like really far away from it? How close would you say I was? Like 15 minutes or so? If it's 15 minutes or so, I can keep going. But if it's about an hour, then no, I, I might have to stop and wait for next time. It's after this section, okay. Cool. When we find Owen, thank you for letting me know. Okay, so if we find Owen, um, we know shit's about to go down. That's that's as far as we need to know about that. And Twitch might. This whole damn boat infested. Yeah, it looks like it. others over there. I haven't got any pipe bombs. I was going to do a big old surprise there, but I think that's probably the worst idea I could have. Um, I'll try and stealth my way through. 997701. Was that right? No, it wasn't. Check that code again. 907701? No, I didn't. I'm going to try 907701. If this isn't right, I'm going to have to look at the chat. Because I'm not getting that note out. <laughs> okay, okay, alright. Yes, that was it! Okay, well then that's how bad my memory is then. I told Keris the wrong thing five seconds after reading it. Close quarters combat training. Nice. More things for my supplements to give me juice on. That's nice. Okay, that clicker isn't going anywhere, um, which is good for me. Uh, I also like how they opened the safe, grabbed the um, grabbed the crossbow. Jesus, stop moving. Got 
got you. Yeah, they like took the, they took the crossbow out of the safe and then shut it and locked it again. Maybe I don't know how saves work, but I thought that would take a little bit of time. If you're already in, being chased by infected, I don't think you have the time to sort that out. But maybe I just don't know what I'm talking about. Maybe sh safes automatically lock when you... I don't know. No idea. Shit! Up there! Up there! Okay, well they're coming out this way! Okay, shotgun time. <laughs> Fuck. I mean, okay, that got it in one shot. That's really good to know, but still. Well, I mean, I did fire an another round at it, but still. Oh, shit, I'm not reloaded. Fuck. Got ya. The thing I love about these games is that every bullet matters. I love that. that Commander Nidoquake subscribed. Thank you so much. Oh, jeez. I saw that. I saw that. Um, they're not called bloaters. What they're called? Shamblers. I saw a sham. I saw that shambler, and I thought, oh shit, that's the end of me. That's it. Okay, anything going on in here? Oh, that hunting pistol did me a good job then. Very proud of you, hunting pistol. Well done. Although I'm probably going to need to get my assault rifle out this time. Yeah, I need another one of these, don't I? Oh yeah, what can I do with my sup? Oh god, I've got loads of supplements. Listen mode range, that's probably pretty useful. Momentum... Uh, hunting pistol ammo? Uh, no. Um, okay, I'm going to go for the range and the distance. Actually, no. Health. I could do with more health. on the boat no okay then through the door we go right got my rifle anything up here Nice, got some supplies. What's going on here? Vancouver, sickness, infirmary. Uh, dead, wrestled him. Despite protests, climbing with it. ailments. Visual landfills, Seattle. No answer. Yeah, okay. Everything went to shit, basically. Okay. Oof. Anything over here? Ah, I knew it. Thanks for the Utah coin. Oh God, another fucking enemy area. Jeez. Give me a break. <laughs> Please give me a break. Let's try 
Oh yeah, I fell down the water, didn't I? Yeah. So I was on that bridge earlier and then I fell right down and I should have just landed here. Wow. That was the biggest ring around of roses I've ever seen. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Whatever you say, abs. Okay. Yep. Last few encounters have been quite tense, so I'm just prepping myself. Ah. Anything around here that's going to give me a surprise? Nope. up here. Can't climb on them. That's fine. Lots of skeletons. At least they're not bodies. Unless skeletons then become alive in this game. I wouldn't, wouldn't be surprised at this point. Can I go up here? Yes, I can. Okay, what's around here? Hmm. Get back up there. Can I jump onto the bus? No, I cannot. But now I'm going to slide down and never get back up again, which usually means I'm about to be attacked. No? Okay. Whatever you say, boss. You know what, I'll swap my ammo out just for regular shotgun shells. Yeah, I like flame rounds. They're cool. They are cool. Okay. Okay, this must be an enemy area. Must be. There's grass. To hide in. Well, there's the Ferris wheel. Uh, one shotgun shell or one crossbow arrow. I think I'll probably take my chances with the crossbow arrow. Aquarium, here we go. So this is where we might find Owen, and this is where something might happen which might get me knocked off of Twitch, so... When the cutscene starts, I'll go into intermission, and then I'll report back afterwards. Let's have a little look around here first. Knowing my luck, that was probably a secret area in the aquarium, and I'm going to go past a non-skippable reverse point here, and that'll be the end of that. Let's have a look. Anything around here that I can grab? Nope. Nope, can't get in there. Anything around here I can get? Nope. Okay then, let's see what happens. Owen? Owen? Owen, come on! He's gotta be in the back somewhere. Mm-hmm. Doing what? 
is the question. He's doing Twitch bannable acts. That's what he's doing. Maybe this is the way I was supposed to go. Okay, over the fence. Okay, anything around here I can grab? Oh, I've got some rope here. Nice. Can I get in here? Right. Blur it out. Right, I don't know if this is what I should be doing, but... No, probably not. Okay, alright, that's fine. Oh, okay, I got ya, I got ya. So I need to throw a brick or something up there. assuming, anyway. Mm, okay, maybe not. Um, ah, that's how we do it. Right, so throw it out this way. Then I can climb up it. Physics puzzles. Can I go through here? Nah. Right, up we go. Yeah, he better be worth it. All this bloody meandering. Okay. So now the question is... Right, okay. Okay, where are we? Swear to God, if you give me shit about this glass. Hmm. Where's sneaky little Owen? Where's he hiding? Okay. Okay, your pack's here. Is that blood? Classy one, 68 bit cheer, thank you so much. Is it possible for you to just cut the video but allow us to see your reaction? Um, y yes, but I, again, I'm not sure, like, because I don't, because I'm not, because I haven't got headphones on, I don't know if, it, if it's going to pick up noises from the TV. I don't know if Twitch has audio recogn recognizing algorithms because youtube does so i i'm, I'm hey, gonna Owen. just i'm gonna play it safe i think this one time once i once i understand the rules a little bit better and i can take a few more risks then yeah but i don't i do not want to get anything fucked with my twitch channel just yet i've just started ah oh, we're back here Out we go. Owen. Okay, who turned the music on? That's not funny. God damn it. Is this really the safest thing to be doing? Like calling out someone's name in the middle of this? I don't know, it just seems unsafe. his place is probably in there or he went into the gaping maw of the shark let's have a look uh, 
Ah. Of course. Ah, we're back here. Okay. So he must be on the Ferris wheel then. Or on the boat. Could be on the boat. Um. Ah, there we go. Right, okay, right. Owen? Right, if he's in here... Yeah? I'm going to hold it as long as I can. Isaac sends you after me. He didn't. I'm going to leave it as long as I can. What is all this? You're not going to want like what that's for, love. I'm going to fix her back up. That's going to go on one appendage, and then it's going to do something to the other end. I think. Suit yourself. Danny's dead. Figured. I'm ready to. I'm ready to hit intermission. I'm ready. You want to tell me what happened? We were. Cleaning out of the small camp. Yeah, I love it when you talk dirty. Just a couple scars and uh, hit this one on the head. Yeah, I bet you did. Hard. Oh, hard. And he goes down. On you? And his weapon's right there. Are they doing this on purpose? He doesn't go for it. Instead, he turns to me. And he's old and tired. Oh, hey, Moth. He was just ready. Kill a lot of scars. And, uh,. I couldn't do it. Of course, Danny gets in my fucking face about it. I told him I'm done. He can do it himself if he wants. And he points his fucking gun at me. So I grab it, and then... First, I didn't even know which one of us was shot. Defended yourself. Stop. I can fix this. I'll talk to Isaac. I am tired, Abby. I don't want to fight over land that I don't give a fuck about anymore. I'm going to Santa Barbara. The chaser rumor? I've heard it more than once. The Fireflies aren't regrouping. They're gone. It's a lead. You gotta see it through. <sighs> what about Mel? Be safe here. Okay. We'll talk in the morning when you're sober. Don't do that. Do what? Treat me like I'm fucking insane. You feel the same way. If the fireflies are in Santa Barbara, I go the opposite fucking direction. Sorry, I grew up. You should try it. 
Oh yeah, how do I do that? Oh God. Should I go find the people that killed my family? Cut into them? I could torture them until they're crying now. <laughs> I'm holding it. 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 No, not that. I'm holding. I'm holding on the mouse. Not. No. Look, my hands are here. I'm not holding anything. Oh no! No, just go, 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 go. That was angry. What? Right, let's carry on. <laughs> that was very, very angry. They clearly, um, um, I don't know if get off's the word, but they clearly, um... Like, it, it excites them, like, killing excites them a little bit more than it probably should. Oh, no! Yeah, someone in the chat said that was unnecessary. I mean, yeah, maybe, but I mean, A, people have sex. That's just what people what? do. I, I know, I know. People have sex. B, when they're emotionally charged, that's probably more likely. And C, she thought he died. They'd lost each other. They don't know what they're going to do. Like, are they going to go off together? It's, it's, it's a pivotal moment, so I, I get it. Well... One chop is asking on a scale of Fahrenheit to heavy rain. How was it? I mean, it was the most realistic I've seen so far in a game. I'll give it that. More right, more, more, more realistic than ride to hell with the um the dungaree onesies not being taken off while static dry humping everything, with the face of pure death and soulless ecstasy. Okay, we're on Seattle day two then. Okay, so I think we should probably stop here. Oh my goodness gracious. Well, that was a great place to end. Oh, thank you so much, everybody. <laughs> for oh, the classy one came out with 69 bits at the best time. I know I said I'd stop with the 69, but that was hilarious. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I am going to, um, I'm going to stop now. Um, thank you so much for joining me. Two days time, says on the top left of this video. There, there? Yeah, over there. Says every Monday, Friday, and Wednesday at 10 p.m. BST. And um, then we'll we'll come back to it. Oh, thank you again, Classy168 Bits. Thanks for another great stream. Look forward to the next one. All the best to anyone there. If you want to know the root of the 69 Bits thing, then check the Discord. Oh, okay. So it's going on in there, is it? Okay, got ya. Ooh. Okay, anyway. Thank you, Aethera Prism. I miss you too. Um, Simon Vegeta, loved it. Thank you. That's very, very kind of you. But yeah, I'm going to head off, guys. It is uh, nearly 2 a.m. Hope you enjoyed. Stay safe, my lumpies and germs. Wash your hands. Oh, yes. God, yes. Let's raid somebody. Okay. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. Let's raid somebody. And now I've got this new, like, I've got this new mic stand now. So now I can actually, um, let's raid. Oh, let's, oh, let's raid stop skeletons from fighting. He needs more people in there. He's got 44 people. He needs more people. Let's do it. Hopefully that worked. 
I never know if it does or not. This stuff confuses me. But either way, I'm going to go now. But yeah, we've just raided him. So good night, everybody. I'll see you in a few days.